to collect and connect online. This will allow you to make your gameplay information visible to other players all over the world. I mean, I'm already connected online, so I guess there's no need. Whatever. Eh, nah, I probably don't need to go online. Then it can be done, uh, the, the, buys Waddle Dee, then checking, whatever. Uh, a Kirby game that's a bit wilder and more challenging. This adventure will be tough at times, but you'll collect lots of star coins as a reward. A Kirby game that's simple to play. You'll have a lot of health for this adventure. Perfect for those who are new to action games. Um, uh, I could, I could probably handle it. I, I don't think I'm that bad. I'll do wild mode. Oh, that's cute. Hello, hello, my lovely viewers. Welcome, welcome, once and all. It is time for your favorite voice you can't forget, the lovely Vitamin DGR, aka V. Back at it again for you, my lovely connoisseurs of the, oh, it's so cute, connoisseurs of the culture. I hope I can do this. Uh, Nintendo, I do not take credit for this. I hope I don't get this cut. YouTube, if this gets cut, then I apologize. Actually, just in case I'm gonna lower the music. Hello, everyone, uh, my fellow connoisseurs of the culture. I know this is gonna be a bit different from what the normal games are that I play, but, I've been in a bit of a state. Uh, I don't usually try to make this channel... I mean, they, we might have our heavy moments, yeah. But I usually try to, like, have some simple times. Uh, and I'm, I'm cheered up. I'm cheered up. I'm definitely better. But to be fair, for lack of a better term, my day wasn't really the best. Uh, I, we get it. We all have our bad days. A lot of just misfortunate things happen. Don't worry. Everyone's healthy. Everyone's good. It was just problem after problem after problem. And I was like, you know what? I need something light and gentle and cute to like cheer me up. So I figured I, well, I'm getting all twisty. Ugh. That doesn't look comfortable, Curbs. Uh, hope you're okay. Okay, I think we're we're good. I can turn off the music, I think. Uh, yeah, so you can probably tell by the title of this video. Uh, I needed a cure for, you know, putting myself in a better mood. Something to like, not that I shouldn't be in a bad mood. Like, I want to be in a good mood. So I figured, I think I know the perfect thing. So, welcome, lovely viewers, my fellow connoisseurs of the culture, to Kirby and the Forgotten Land for the Nintendo Switch. No, I am not sponsored. No, I, uh... uh no, I'm not sponsored. Uh, and no, Nintendo, please do not harp on me. Not in a bad way, but I, I hope I'm able to play this. So, I guess we'll find out. Uh, but yes, I decided to bust out the Switch. Normally, I would have done something different, like a different, like, game, or, I don't know, maybe some sort of, like, anime thing, which usually would cheer me up. But I decided, you know what, I really should go out of my, uh, comfort zone for this. So, I will say this right now, uh, before we go too further into this, uh, I'm aware that there's a potential for some weird, uh... Video delay, so I apologize. I am trying my best, but uh, yeah, I'm not gonna go too much into this. Let's just have a good time, okay? So I can eat with that. Uh, plus, I love Kirby. Kirby's my favorite Nintendo. Uh, in case anybody didn't know, Metro would be my second. Uh, but yeah, when it comes to Nintendo, usually I get like super excited for Kirby, and well, I already knew I was super excited for this bad boy. Great time a little late to the party, but eh, better than nothing. Okay, A's jump, hail. How long can I inhale for? Ooh, a really long time. Uh, cool. Okay. Of course, the typical Kirby fly. Oh, I can't fly for long. Okay. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm just getting a hand on the quest on the game. And eh, whatever. I'll do it as it. It's Kirby. It can't be that bad. Uh, yes. Yeah, so I'll be playing Kirby in the Forgotten Land. But as you might know, it is a one visit. For those who are new to me, I I know how to jump. I just practiced it like two seconds ago. Uh, for those who do not know how I roll, uh, I do these random times where I call one vi- Ooh, something shiny. I'll take these. I do these random things called one visits, where I randomly play a game, one to three episodes. If viewers want to see more, they let me know, and I will definitely do more. I've had a few that were like that, like Tokobot, One Piece, Master Detectives. Uh, there's been a few, and I don't know, maybe this might be one of them, but to be fair, I really just wanted to play this because I wanted- I wanted something neat, right? I, I didn't want to- I don't want to, like I said, I'm in a better mood, but I still feel a little iffy, to say the least. Uh, anything over there? Oh. Uh, uh, I still feel a little iffy, to say the least. So I figured, oh, well, then I might as well play something light and cozy. Granted, it was either this or, uh, Kirby's Extra Epic Yarn, or Star Allies, or Return to Dreamland Deluxe, but, uh, I just wanted to do Forgotten Land. Plus, I mean, look at this. This sounds beautiful. 
I don't know. Uh, I will say this because I might forget to do it while I have this. Uh, oh, gotta, gotta joke off with this. Uh, I will say this in case any viewers are, you know, in a good kind mood. This is separate from my bad mood, iffy mood. Uh, if you guys want to show some support, if you want to like, I don't know, help my channel out, I greatly appreciate. Holy, Broly! Woo! Look at this. Oh, and this music. Oh, I'm already feeling so good. Oh, this is the trailer music. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I thought I said I recognize the song. Uh, but yeah, uh, if you guys want to show some support to little old me and help the channel, help the offices of Vitamin DGR, I greatly appreciate any support you have for me. Uh, why not follow me on my Twitch under the handle of Vitamin DGR? Uh, you can also subscribe. All proceeds help generously. I really want to... I'm crying. Get in me. Oh, it's automatic? don't have to like press down i'm more used to like other games but it's whatever uh i'm guessing v is attack yeah because that's usually how it is i, I played pretty games before i knew that i'm link kirby oh this is so cute and it's so like positive oh gosh i need like you know what's nice about oh right i should probably finish my uh, whole plugin thing uh youtube you can also subscribe too uh and why not like the video if you find this cute and find this enjoyable or you're like wow v didn't think this would be your kind of speed uh I, all the things will greatly help that lovely little loaf of dog that i have as an avatar but uh yeah i gotta say like my knowledge of kirby is very pretty good that's not proper things Hello, Risotto. Welcome, welcome. But it's also a good thing I'm playing something like this because I was like, you know what? I've done, like, all these crazy games, all these serious games. It's kind of nice to, like, try something different. Something a little nicer. Risotto jumped in saying the usual eating buddy, uh, eating burger with a honey mustard thing. It's just a little silly. Uh, why to drop ability? What if I want to get? Well, it's automatic when I do it. All right. I want you because you're... Bomb Kirby, right? Yeah. Well, you look different, though. I know my Kirby modes. I played Nightmare in Dreamland and returned to... Actually, there's a lot of Kirby games I played. Holy moly. Does this tell me how to... Oh, I guess not. Ugh, you know what I missed, though? Is, like, in the 3DS version... Actually, in a lot of the handheld versions, they will usually have, like... When you pause the game, it'll tell you, like, Oh, this is Bomb Kirby. Bomb Kirby's good for, like, blowing things up. This is how you utilize it. Uh, let's see. Risotto says games back then are more of a puzzle based, do they? Uh, are more of a puzzle based, do they? Um, I mean, yeah. Granted, I think this is the first like adventure game. Well, okay, so Kirby has usually been like platformer puzzle action kind of game, right? Like action puzzle platformer, maybe adventure technically. Uh, but what I found interesting about Kirby was even back then. There wasn't really many 3D Kirby games. Like, there was only one other that I know of, and that was 64, uh, the Crystal Shards. Unless anybody out there knows uh, anything differently, but I'm pretty confident on it. Man, I got the throw. Ooh, good throw me. Uh, but yeah, this is like the second 3D game Kirby's done. And honestly, considering the fact the last one was 64, oh, Jeff's kiss. This looks freaking beautiful. I can't read what that says. So, uh, I, uh, I can't read it. Where'd my bombo go? Oh, I guess movie cut-ins don't qualify. Can't render your bomb hat. Hmm. Oh, it's so adorable, even though they're enemies because they look angry at me. Am I gonna eat them? I'm gonna eat them, all right. Yep. Uh, Kirby, you ate them. Kirby, you can stop. Kirby! That's, that's too much. Ugh! <laughs> don't you... You don't know where that car's been. Kirby's like, Poyo, it's been in my mouth. Excuse me. Get a ball. I forgot I shouldn't be referring to you as I'm a car. I love it. Now Kirby is a convertible. Is a... Would it be appropriate to call him Carby? <laughs> Okay, alright, I'll see you guys later. Okay, so I can jump and do this. Okay, cool beans. 
Get out of my flipping way! Wow, I'm just running into everything. I should probably get a lot of these coins for whatever I'm being. Oh, that's so good. The car vertible. The curve vertible. Nah, I think Kirby's better. I can't really think of any other thing, any other puns with Kirby in the name. Although, Kirby, cool as this is, you should really, like, make sure you properly, like, you gotta watch what you eat, man. Eventually you have to lose weight. Like, I've seen an episode of Kirby Rice back at, uh, Kirby's Right Back at you. You were, like, super overweight and, like, heavy and fat. Same with, uh, King DD. Yes, viewers, I remember watching the crap out of that when I was little. God, that used to be my show. Uh, what do we got over here? Oh, that looks important. All right, cool. I will say this, Twitch. Uh, one last time. Uh, I'll try my best not to... And you know what? I'll wait until more people potentially show up. But in case there aren't, and I'll say this. Uh, yes, there's some weird delay. I've noticed. I do not know how to fix it. I would only recommend... Uh, oh, maybe refreshing your browsers. That might make things a little bit better. Money! more of it wait i just realized i got my little hat i got my little like feet dangling is this comfortable for kirby can i do anything else it no i don't jump oh oh uh what i just do i press something what i just press what i press uh d-pad oh it's so cute i wish i could honk all right well whatever Sorry, viewers, I'm just joking around here. But this is going to be different because 3D Kirby hasn't really been a thing in, like I said, gosh knows how long. I don't know when exactly Crystal Shards came out. I do know it was a long time ago. Hmm? Uh oh. Oh, this sounds like licensed music. It's cute, but I don't want to play it. I'm sorry, I got to mute it. I'm sorry, I don't want to get in trouble with YouTube. Strange Horizon, ready to go. Oh, well, that's totally what that says. Oh, Kirby in the Forgotten Land. Sorry, uh, Twitch and YouTube. I... Well, Twitch, I know I'm probably okay, but these videos go to YouTube, and I don't have editing capabilities, so I'd rather... I'd rather just do the safe thing and just look at this cute little cutscene in silence and just talk with you guys. Instead of getting the video in trouble. If I haven't got... Oh! Oh, they're so cute. So we're not in the normal world now, huh? We're in a different world. We're not in a pop star. I mean, yeah, my knowledge of Kirby is going to be not super great. Probably because I just can't think properly right now. But I do know our planet pop star or Kirby's home planet pop star was like the little star we saw in the earlier cutscene. So I guess I'm not there anymore. I don't know where I am other than, I guess, the pun of it being a forgotten land. Or forgotten land, man. Adventure is waiting you in the new fields of the new world. I'm certain somebody at this point will probably play the music. Oh, way to go, Hal. All right, I think that probably means it's done. Yes. Okay, cool. We're in there. Yeah, like I said, YouTube, I don't want to get in trouble, so I apologize. Unless anyone knows I can get away with doing it without getting in trouble, then please let me uh, comment. All of these. Oh, I got pulled in that weird star thingy, too. Canada Road. Get the heck out. Unless I go back the other way, I... Okay. Fuck! So... I don't just eat this thing. It's just... Hmm. All right, well, whatever. Oh, hold on. My thing is going... Uh, alright. Hopefully I don't have any double voice or anything like that. Just in case, I'm just gonna take this time right now. I've been having some weird things, uh, viewers, with, um my audio, so I'm hoping that we don't have any double voice uh, circumstance going on. Naturally, I'll be relying on Twitch because they're quicker to respond to this. Uh, but YouTube, please let me know as well. Don't think just because Twitch is, whoops. Don't think just because Twitch is quicker with this doesn't mean I don't read YouTube comments. Oh, the little pitter patter Kirby's feet, man. This was such a good idea. Seriously, this was such a good idea. What happened here? Kirby, did you blow things up again? No, I didn't. Oh, yeah? Oh, more of the little furry guys. What are these birds doing? They're... You could squeeze through that. Sort of. Actually, do all of these have bones? 
Yeah, surely they can squeeze through uh, the little gar uh, bars there. Oh, oh, don't do, don't, don't do those eyes. Oh, those eyes are are sin. Don't, those are eyes are must be illegal. Also, uh, whatever this thing is has a. Does it want to take a bite out of its ear? Did you guys bite this thing's ear off? Adamant freedom! The revolution must begin! Hang on, I'll save you. Uh, I'm assuming that's what I have to do. Uh. Hmm. Can I throw farther? Nope. Get out of way! Oh, uh, okay. One for you and one for you. Who else? Who else? No. No. Oh, I guess that one's still walking the bomb. Nice! Victory, Kirby! I don't want, oh, I just touched it? Okay, cool. I did it! I'm the best. Oh. You know what? There are great dancers in the world. You can talk? Okay. There are great dancers in the world. Like, uh, any pop band, like BTS, Michael Jackson, but I'm not gonna lie, Kirby might have them beat. And I dare anyone to challenge me on that one. Also, that was so adorable. Sorry, viewers, I might be acting a little differently. I'm, I'm really relying on this. Again, I'm in a good mood. I'm definitely in a much better mood now. But gosh, Kirby just... Kirby just is like... I think Kirby is like chicken noodle soup. Like, it's good for the soul. Sorry, right, let's just get to it. Uh, Let's see, what voice should I give you? You know what? Let's just let's just be goofy. Phew! Yeah, you saved me. Yeah, thank you. Eh. Hey, what about those other guys? Uh, what, what, uh, what do you call them? The waddle -doos? The, the waddle -don'ts? What's a waddle don't? Uh, waddle dees, yeah, 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 we're all captured and taken away and whatever. Yeah, we fought those beasts as hard we could, whatever, but, uh, they kept coming back for more. Now I'm the only one left. Oh, uh, the what? Oh, well, I guess I gotta save him. I gotta go save him. I got to. Where did this warp star come from? What the flip is that? Would you, would you just do that? What? You'll help me save everyone, and somehow I can understand you just saying one thing? Cool, it's great. So, your name's Carby? Uh, that's interesting. Hey, you know that's the name of a vacuum company? Uh, and you know what? Nobody needs to know that. I'm Elphilin. Nice to meet you. Well, aren't you just the most adorable thing? Are you gonna be following me? Oh, you're so cute. Oh, good. I was about to say, if I had to go through this whole adventure without, like, a friend, I'd be kind of lonely. Hey, Kirby. Oh, Bandanity. Man, I haven't seen you since, uh... Like, play co-op with a pause menu to have P2 control Bandana Waldy. Work together by playing together. Oh, that'd be great if I wasn't lonely. That's <sighs> nah, all good. Uh, oh, you're also talk? Oh boy, am I glad to see you! Oh, I got pulled through that vortex over Planet Popstar, too! Actually, I should probably give Bandana D a more like. Boy, am I glad to see you. I got pulled through that vortex over Planet Popstar, too. Yeah, I wanna give. Bandana D is a Chad. Like, he's definitely like the Sigma male. If anyone's played any recent Kirby games, or again, 64, then you understand Bandana D is top dog. I'm giving him like the chillest voice I could possibly do it. If you ever want a second player to join you, just let me know. I'll always be ready. Have fun. Oh, uh, you got more to talk? If you want a second player, oh, uh, okay. Uh, just call me anytime through the pause menu. I'll rush over. Even if you were like, halfway across the world. Trust me, thanks to the power of video game logic, I'll always be there. Oh, that's so cool. No, well, unfortunately I'm going solo, but here, you can have that. <gasps> oh no! May I ask why you did that? Uh, I don't know. Sorry. It's okay, so if I had two-player mode, it'd be me and Bandanity. Alright, well, it's it's cool. I get to have some fun with Curbs. This is the world map, huh? Level-based? Uh, what is that in the distance? Some sort of gate thingy. Natural Plains. Oh, listen to this! Downtown Grassland? Okay, I dig it, I dig it. Uh... Stage list? Well, where do I begin? Hey, Kirby, let's go save those captured Waddle Dees or whatever. There's 46 Waddle Dees? 
All right. Wait, to Waddle Dee Town? What's Waddle Dee Town? Oh, wait, was that where I just was? Oh, 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 let me guess. I'm gonna find Waddle Dees. That weird vortex pulled me into the sky. I had no idea what was happening. I still don't. At least I found the other Waddle Dees. It looked like they arrived in this new world just before me. I was searching high and low for our friends, and I saw an odd pink car dash by. I'm guessing that was you, huh, Carby? <laughs> Sorry, just made myself chuckle with that one. That looked quite like a mouthful. That looked like quite a mouthful? Okay. Wait, wait, hold on. That looked like quite a mouthful. Everything okay in there? Don't bite off more than you can chew? Yeah, okay, thanks, buddy. So, I'm gonna go on a limb here and assume I'm gonna go save Waddledees. I know, I know, hang on. I'm gonna go save Waddledees and bring them back here. I mean, I, I guess I can't store them inside me. Please don't take that out of context. Alright, uh, well, I guess I'll just do it. Wait, I can fly anywhere. Whoa! I can press the trigger to move really quick. Kind of awesome. Okay, so, one... I'm guessing the big spots are levels two... Three, four, is this big enough? No. This big? No. Then, whatever the heck this thing is, that looks bad. Alright, cool. I dig it. Well, let's just not waste any time. What? Wait, what was that? What was that? Something just. Oh. Well, there's stuff in the overworld to search for? Hold on, I'm gonna turn this down a little bit. Okay, well then, I'll worry about that once I get through the levels. Let's go to downtown Grassland. Uh. I understand what this means. You know what? Whatever. Let's just do it. I'm sure it'll be pleasant. Oh, Evelyn! Oh, you're not with me? Oh, I guess you're technically with me, but not... I was kind of hoping you... He... She... I don't know what gender you are if you have a gender. I don't want to, like, assume gender. Get him! Get him! Bomb! Fine, I'll do it myself. I don't know what gender... Eflin is, which is going to be bad if I gave Eflin the- well, I don't know, I've seen things like uh, Hell of a Boss and Has-Been Hotel, so they can have girl characters, guy characters, and multi-gender characters sound like this. You should be assuming genders there, Kirby. So what gender are you? Don't worry about it. Make five tulips bloom. Oh, they're like little uh, things to do when I get rewards? Okay. Find five tulips. And so one down. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. Just trying to remember what the button. Well, it's automatic inhale. I'm not used to that. So, I'm more used to, like, the handheld games where normally on, like, a 3DS or Game Boy Advance, which I still have them, uh, I would have to, uh... That music's a little loud, huh? You guys can't barely hear me. Uh, I'd be more used to, like, pressing the down button to just, like, absorb it, or I could just spit it out. So it's interesting, like, not having to worry about that. I don't know, I kind of like... I don't know if how I feel about having, like, some sort of weird auto-inhale thingy. Oh, I can hold the thing charged. Ooh. Can't throw it all that far, though. Oh, at least this game's so pleasant. Oh, this game's so cute. Ooh, got some stuff over here. Anything? Nothing? Go down here? No? Okay. Yeah, so I'm more used to, like, those like those capabilities. I'm not really used to, like, auto-inhale. Ooh, hold on. Pathway. Hello? Wait, didn't I go this way? Oh, there was a wall there. Got it, got it, got it. Okay. Wow, there's gonna be secrets. I'm gonna have to pay attention. I mean, duh, I have to pay attention, but still. Checkpoint! What was that saying? Mouthful. Wait, I can still eat things despite having a power? Bending... <laughs> bending mouth? How many mouth... Mouthful mode whatever thingies... Uh, you know what? Instead of asking, let's just play the game. Ah! I'm too... I'm too tall! Eh. But I got the power of bending machines. I'll fill you guys full of carbonated death. Shouldn't be wasting my shots just in case any of this. Probably a reason why they gave me 99. But yeah, that's interesting. So I can turn to these modes despite having a power. 
I'm not used to that. I figured I had to inhale, which meant I had to, like, back up. Break the building's shutter. Oh, I get Waldies for him. Oh, okay. Then it might be worth... Ugh. Can't... Ugh. I can't jump. Get me. You gotta spit it out. I don't want to spit it out. It's disgusting. Ugh. Wish I could understand what... The... What language are... is this, like, world supposed to be? If it is a language. Capsule thing? Alright, well, whatever that is, I'll claim it. Whee! Oh, you're a big one. Hmm. Oh, uh, nope. Can't eat that. Yes, again. Oh, I... How do I... I don't know what button I pressed to absorb it. Wait. Oh, I can taunt? Oh, that's cute. cute. That's still the D-pad, by the way. Oh, I get different ones. Oh. oh. I get four different taunts. So, this one's up. Which is cute. This one's left. This one's down, and this one's right. So we get four taunts. Okay, that's kind of cute. I wonder why I couldn't do it in car mode. Because you can't move when you're a car. I mean, you can't dance and stuff. Duh. Uh, I guess that makes sense. Sorry, Eflin. Someone's got to tell me what gender Eflin is. Despite being... I mean, I guess... I wonder if cute is a gender. Probably is. You're so adorable you don't need a gender? Yeah, probably. Probably more uh, appropriate. Oops! Actually, hold on. Are there like options? Uh, oh, control settings. Perfect. Uh, let's see. Move, crouch, guard. Oh, oh, auto swallow. Oh, yeah, no, nuts that crap. Uh, crouch, guard, swallow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I prefer that. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not really feeling auto jump. Use stock items. Whatever. Auto swallow was turned off. Well, I mean. Okay, let's let's not make those jokes. It's Kirby. All right, how many uh, tulips? It's kind of nice to like help me keep track of things. Uh, keep track of things. Whoa. Okay, so I press the triggers now in order to swallow. Which I don't want anyone taking this out of context because it's Kirby. We're gonna be mature about this, right, viewers? We're not gonna make any weird iffy jokes about uh swallowing, right? Just say it right now. Not do that. This too? What? <laughs> Own mouth Kirby? Yeah, okay, game. Uh, jump B to spike downward? Oh, I got like a like a ground pound kind of deal. Okay, I dig it. I time it right! <laughs> I love my little waddle. Hey, hold on, let me get rid of this guy. So the car had four taunts. I wonder... Oh, go Kirby! Oh, I only have... Oh, I, I guess Mouth Emote. Sorry, I was I was pressing the buttons because I was like, I wonder if I still have four taunts. I'm guessing Mouthful Modes only have one taunt. Hmm. That looks suspicious. <clears throat> if there's one Nintendo character I would truly love to be, it would totally be Kirby. Think about it. Adorable... Is to have all these crazy powers, can eat as much as he wants. It's the ladies. Like, Kirby is the ideal. I mean, yeah, there's Mario and Wario, and everyone wants to be Waluigi. I get it, but come on. Like, Kirby. Okay, I was hoping that would work. I was quiet because I was like, I hope this works. Ooh, Tulip. <laughs> Can't really jump in these, like, alpha modes all that well. Oh. Cool. Excuse me. Well, there's no secrets I'm missing. I'm gonna try my best. Granted, these are one visit, so I'm probably not gonna take it overly serious, but I will say this, viewers, if... Oh, almost messed up the jump. Ride the spewing water up to the balcony. Oh, okay, cool. Uh, if you viewers do want more of this, then, I, like I said, please let me know in the comment section, and please make sure to follow and subscribe. And like the video too, YouTube. I know I'm asking a lot, but... Whoa! Ooh! Sorry, I was going back here in case I missed something. Okay, I didn't. Uh, but no, honestly, it really does help out. I mean, Kirby's already doing its job, but, you know, I use some other help, too. Mm. Wish I could keep these mouth modes. Oh, well, that's obvious where I need to go. Hey, can you save me? 
Oh, uh, ooh, uh, I get to choose my flavor. Um, I think I like, I'm more of a spicy kind of guy. I don't really like food that like cut, like that are too sharp, like cheddar. So I'm going to stick with bomb. What's this? Go away. Oh, ooh. Whoa. Wait. Ugh. Oh, okay. Ugh. Ugh. God, my bombs don't. My bombs don't do all that much. Ugh. Ugh. Oh, hey, already. Wild Edge, you are a classic uh, Kirby enemy, but you look different. What's with the fur coat, dude? It's because of the hunt. I hunted many a game. Like I've been in many. Whoa, you have double slash. Okay. Oh, you have triple slash. Hunted a mini game. I'm used to being able to do a lot more. Why can I? Can I angle the throw. Can I put it on top of you. Oh, well, never mind. Ooh. Ah. Ugh. Actually, you know what? Screw the bomb. Let me eat you. Get in my belly. Can I taunt with this thing in me? No. Okay. Yeah, that wild edge is a very uh. Oh, no, not me. Give me. Hey. Oh, okay. So I need to save three of them a mission. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. Makes sense. Makes sense. God, this game is just so. How do you not? How do you not be in a good mood playing games like this? I can't think of a single time I played a Kirby game and was in a bad mood. Oh, okay. It can't overpower you. Noted. I don't know, like, Kirby doesn't feel like the kind of game that people can play in a bad mood. It feels like the kind of game that people will be in a bad mood and be in a good mood. Which I know it may make sense. Uh, like, if you're in a bad mood, you'll be in a good mood. And if you're in a good mood, you'll be in a greater mood. This is Mouthful 2? Dome Mouth? Oh, oh, okay, cool. Oh, oh, alright, there was one. Kind of a little lackluster, but that's adorable, still, nonetheless. Remember what that Waddle Dee, uh, that bandana one said, Kirby. Oh, hello. That bandana one said, don't bite off more than you can chew. Kirby's like... Boy, oh. <laughs> don't worry, I am the legendary Kerbo. The brainchild. The savior of Nintendo. I'm basically the Jesus of Nintendo. And I hope people have watched Terminal Montage to understand what references I'm making here. Ah! The heck is that thing over there? What are you? What are you looking at? Oh, I don't have like sword beamers. Oh, because I'm not. I'm hurt. Actually, I don't even know if I have that in this game. Uh, some Kirby games do like the Legend of Zelda thing. I know where if you're at full health, you can get like sword beams and stuff. Hmm. Wee. Oh, back to cone again. Oh, I love the little hat. Standing on the cone mouth. Oh, it's cute. Aww. Quiet. Sleepy. Don't disturb it. Good little dog. Sleep. Alright, now. Uh, whoa! Hey, hey, whoa, hey, hey. Oh. Eat this! Ugh. Ooh, that's kind of violent. Oh. Eh. Well, that was quick. All right. That's that's it, right? Oh, except for probably beating the stage. Right? Yeah, yeah. Clear the stage. Wait. They filed to... Oh, okay. Okay. I wonder if it's every level will have, like, five different little uh, sub-quest thingies. One is probably going to be clear the stage, and... I'm assuming the other one, because it's, like, also big, would be get the Waddle but the other three... I don't know, they might be, like, different to other stages? I guess we'll find out. I shouldn't be just assuming. I should wait till I get to stage two. Or is this technically called stage two? Stage three. Whatever the next stage is, before I figure that out. Uh, where is this? So, I don't know what this Forbidden Land thing is. I am one of those people that is aware of the whole, like, the Kirby conspiracy. 
Not to be like really weird to people, but I'm gonna humor you guys. The whole whoa, hello, giant bull thingy, and goodbye. Gi oh, hey, thanks for tulip. Bye, giant bull thingy. Um, I right, done it. Sweet. Uh, but there's a conspiracy. Uh, that um, well, Kirby's obviously in Pop Star, but this was discovered. I don't know where its proper discover was. I think it was the same. Whoa. Ah, couldn't move quick enough. What? Wait. Giant turtle. Oh, gee, yeah, definitely giant turtle. Uh -huh. oh, oh, I got time. Cool. Gotta hide here real quick and eat corn. Some nice, delicious maize. And you, uh... Thanks. Ooh, I see the gold things in the window here. Oh. I think I know what I gotta do here. But there's a whole conspiracy about, uh... It's Kirby 64. Uh, there's this planet... So you travel to different planets at Kirby 64? He has no idea. Poor fool. I hope he had a nice little enjoyable life. <laughs> Very painful. Very violent, Kirby. Jeez, and I thought Mortal Kombat was violent, but Kirby might be even more, like, uh, ruthless. Um, let me just get this real quick. So there's a... In Kirby 64, you travel to different planets, and... It... Oh, it's so cute. Uh, Kirby 64, there's a, uh, you travel to these different planets as your levels, and there's a planet in there called Shiver Star, which a lot of people are like, wait, doesn't this just look like Earth? And it, oh, look at it, it's so cute! Kirby, Kirby was pulled into a mysterious vortex that appeared in the sky over his home on planet Popstar. He woke up, he was in a new world. Traveling through that vortex also gave Kirby a new and mysterious power. Let's see what he could do, onward to adventure. Oh, oh, was that when I was all, like, twisted up and all... all shaky like in the intro cutscene when I was all I turned into like a macaroni noodle and one of those weird puffer fish things that probably is also I gotta collect these capsules now great it's not helping my completion assign to me Mitron work sign yeah because I can understand what that means Mitron works company was a massive corporation that invested in research and development with all kinds of fields electro bio astro and more Mitron eventually split up giving rise to many rival companies and countless heated corporate battles how do we know this is Kirby just when he collects his, he just eats it. He's just like, I see all. Oh, uh, Switch. Oh, I guess there's no information on Switch. It's a Switch. It, it does what it does, Kirby. Oh, maybe Eflin uh, tells me. All right, next stage. Through the tunnel. All right, done. Ah, I want nine in this. I wonder if there's nine in every level. Oh, uh, collection? Your figure collection is now available. Use this to view all the figures you collected. See if you can get a full set. Full set? 79? Oh, boy. This is good. Oh. Actually, well, it's not the worst. I don't know. This is the one visit, so I don't know if I need to go for all of them. I'll, I'll leave it to you viewers if you want to see it. Granted, one visits mean I have at least two other episodes. To oh, this looks nicer. Actually, I'm gonna go back here and check it out. Uh, one visits tendently tended to be one to three episodes. So after episode three, if I decide to do more of these, uh, y'all have to let me know if you want more of it. I'm definitely gonna potentially do at least another episode or two. But if you want more, you're gonna have to let me know. Uh, while these are building their town, see as many or save as many as you can to open up new buildings and help with resources. How do they know how to do it? I don't know. They're your friends. Anyway, you can now go to the Waddle D Cinema. It's open. Uh, Rewatch some memorable scenes on the big screen. Scenes. Okay. Cool. Oh, what do you got to say, Vanity? All these are have been hard work. Want to take a look at? Oh, the same thing. Thanks. Okay. Well, let's just take a little look. See. Uh, anything here? No. To arrival point. Oh, where I came from? Nah, I'm good. Oh, I see a little thing. Oh, I get it. As I get more Waldies, I'll get more, like, things. Yeah, okay. So, eh, it's worth getting all the Waldies then. Hmm. I'm not going to need a lot of them. 50 for this. Did I talk to them? No? Get off your lazy button work, Waldy. I guess there's nothing out here. Okay, I'll just come back once I get, like, I guess 50, I guess, the next one. I'll check out the cinema later. Boop, boop, 
I'll go back for a while. All right, so I guess there's nine area. Is this something? This looks suspicious. No? All right. Oh, well, whatever. Let's go through the tunnel. Uh, clear the stage. Oh, okay. There's four here. All right. So I'm going to guess it's always clear the stage and always save the hidden wild bees, but the three of them are different depending on level. Which I guess is makes sense. I should be thinking and talking like this as if I'm like just this is my first Kirby game. Ugh, Nintendo, why do you guys still make such good stuff? Ugh. See, that's the thing with Nintendo. I gotta rant a little bit as I'm playing this. Nintendo doesn't make bad stuff. Like, yeah, some of their hardware could be iffy. <laughs> Wii U. Uh, <laughs> Labo. Uh, but ooh, Fire Kirby? Yeah, I'll take that. Whoa, hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. Uh oh. Oh, yeah. I can set fire to everything. Wow, this fire looks just so... This game's so beautiful. That's what I'm saying. Like, Nintendo makes, like, very good stuff. But compared to, like, Sony and Microsoft, I think what's really great about Nintendo is... I treat Nintendo as anybody can play a Nintendo game, right? Like, Nintendo games are always something that anybody can play in whatever mood, no matter what the circumstance. People will usually be like, hey, you want to, like, go play... Mario Kart or Smash or Kirby in the Forgotten Land. They'd usually be like, yeah, light four lantern switches. Okay. Uh, it'll usually be one of those things where it's like, oh, yeah, I could totally, like, play a, a Kirby game. Why not? Or play a Metroid or things like that. Like, Nintendo's always been known for having, like, a good track record for having these kinds of games that people can play often. And some games that you can just come back to. Like, that's what I really like about Nintendo. Because, yeah, there are some outliers to Sony. Like, you already know, like, if it's a JRPG that I really love, I'll definitely play it again and again. But, separate from that, and because that's my passion, whoops, like, how many PlayStation and Xbox games could you honestly play over and over and over without getting sick of? I know somebody out there is like, well, I can play things like, uh, Halo or Uncharted, and I'm not saying anything bad about it. No, don't get me wrong, those games are great. Any exclusives, too. But the thing that I have is, like, Nintendo's just... Overall, good. Yeah, they may not be always the greatest, but they usually, like, deliver. We can only be so grateful. Oh, I can move as I shoot fire? Okay, I kind of should pay attention. Actually, no, I'm going to go that way. Like, Kirby, I'll always be in a mood for. Mario, always been a mood for. Smash, definitely, as a Smash player. Like, I'll always find, uh... I remember from last time. Switch! I'll always be in a mood to, like, play a good Nintendo game. Oh, uh, find the secret room. Huh! Get away! Ah! Didn't breathe fire quick enough. Alright, we'll take the plan. What the heck is this? Oh! So that's what that sound was. I was like, what the heck is that? Sound. A wow sound. <laughs> that's a funny sound effect. It's going boom wow. Can I not go up there? Alright. Well, if every time Kirby gets a new power, I just start going boom wow. Hey, Kirby, what'd you become? I became Fire Kirby, but wow. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. From here on out, every time I get a power up or I inhale and gain a new, uh, uh, gain an ability, it doesn't have to be new. Anytime I gain an ability, I want everyone to go, but wow. Why did I do that? Oh, okay. I was about to say, why did I spew? Whoa! Whoa. I gotta think like how I play the DS games. Like, unless this tells me. No? Okay. Wait, does it tell me? Darn it. I want to know, like, if there's secret abilities that I can do. Like I said, with the other Kirby games, like, let's use Planet Robobot or Triple Deluxe or Nightmare, well, uh, Squeak Squad or something. Like, it'll usually, like, tell me, oh, this is Fire Kirby. This is what they can do. Uh, uh, or Wheel Kirby. Yeah, he's fast. But these are controls. And then if you do certain things, you get other. Whoa. Uh, don't fall. Please don't fall. Well, I guess I can fly for a minute. I don't know what these coins are useful for, but I'll keep them anyway. Uh, it's one of those things where, like, it will tell me, oh, yeah, you can do this, but if you press, like, A and something else, then you get the ability to do this instead. Unless I just haven't unlocked it yet or something. Oh, let's keep the made a little arrow. Oh, Gordo's here now. So we're not in Popstar, but we still have the enemies that are known in Kirby's world. Unless they all... Well, I guess maybe they all got pulled in... Uh, with the same weird star thing, which I wonder how that came to pass. This coin up here. Boop, boop, beep, boop, boop, beep. 
Boop, boop, beep, boop, boop, beep. I am totally not singing. Well, I know I'm singing it off key, but uh, off beat. But I, I, in my mind, I'm hearing the music. But I realize it's probably gonna sound off beat to you viewers. Let me just let y'all know. I have good rhythm. I can carry a tune. I like to think my singing is pretty all right. I'm pretty confident in my ah. Oh. Pretty confident in my uh, my singing capabilities. So if it sounds like I'm singing off beat, no, it's because streaming can do that to me. Ooh, ham, uh, eggs? Oh, sounds delicious. Oh, go for like... I don't know, something with a lot of meat. I really want some protein. I need a lot of meat, viewers. Don't, uh, don't take that out of context. Whoa! Oh. Turn to, turn to Hank Hill from, uh, King of the Hill. Whoa! Which, by the way, if you viewers want something really random that you didn't ask for, Somebody sent uh, something interesting. I After this video, I'll post it to Discord. So YouTube, if you want to check it out, go to Discord. But if you don't and you don't want to wait it out, then I'll just tell you anyway. Uh, there is a video of... Uh, well, obviously, everyone knows uh, Eminem, the rapper. Uh, but there's a video of... Like, what's his name from King and Hill? Boomhauer? Uh, he sings Eminem's, a cover of Eminem's Rap God. I think it's an AI cover. Uh, but what's really nuts about it is that it actually, like, has the same flow as the rhyme. But what's really cool about it, too, is that it's done in the, stale, uh, the style of Boomhauer. So, for those who don't know, King of the Hill is a very interesting show. I used to have like of it. Like, I used to like the show, and then it was just kind of like, whatever. Why would I... Uh, the Fuse? Oh, hold on. Before I go do the... Oh, I should like the Fuse. Let me see what I'm looking at here first. Okay, so I'm gonna... Oh, well, cool. Game. I already figured it out, but thanks. Okay, so I gotta light the fuse and then run quick. Okay, I can do that. Um, King of the Hill was this old, like, like animated show on Fox. Like, same as... Oh, oh, that's quick. Uh, um, That was basically starring uh, this family, the Hills. Aww. Uh -huh. He'll do that. Okay, that's nice. Whee! Ow. Oh, there you are. Um... I don't really think it even had much of a plot. It was just like a normal like sitcom anime, like American Dad, or oh, Family Guy, Cleveland Show, Bob's Burgers, uh, the failed show, Alan Gregory. Yes, that show sucks and you know it and nobody should remember it. Yes, fight me on that. That show's terrible and you know it. Uh, well, it had heart. No, no, it didn't. Uh, but it's one of those kind of sitcoms, right? Even though I can't think of any memorable moments in King of the Hill other than like, that's my purse. And uh, I think the Hank having testosterone thing. I'm getting off topic. The The point I'm making is there's a... Burn, will ya? Jeez. The point I'm making is there is an episode... Uh, episode. There's a character in... Uh, seriously, this is mouthful? What is just like... Stairs? Stare? Stare mouth? Yeah, okay. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Dude, oh, he's, you know what? He's cute. I can't jump. I can't jump to save my life. This is, hey, put me on the, put me on the team, coach. Can't jump, Kirby. What do you mean? I got hops. Oh, yeah, go ahead. Show me your highest jump. <sighs> can't jump any higher than that. Hang on. Let me just tie my shoelaces real quick. Okay, I'll try it again. <sighs> yeah, I'll just go stay on the benches, coach. Ugh. Anyway, uh, why can I... Oh, I... Oh! Oh, okay. I can do that to, like, crush things. Uh! Wow, that's violent. Uh! That's so satisfying. Oh, gosh. Why is it so satisfying? Hold on. Eh, 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 thanks. Uh, there's a character... So... Hank, the main character, the father, the guy who's like, who sells propane. Well, he sells propane and propane accessories, apparently. Uh, that's his thing. Like, every time you ask Hank, like, what's your job profession, Mr. Hill? He's like, well, I sell propane and propane accessories. Like, he has that kind of credence. Um, that's the proper word. Can I? Oh, okay, cool. I was about to say, I hope I can spit this out and get up there. Um, he has, like, four friends. Uh, 
the other memorable character and probably the only other reason most people watch it is Dale Gribble, who talks like this. His name's Dale Gribble, who's a pest exterminator. Yeah, I'm not joking. He talks like that. He's so funny. He's definitely one of the things that people go for. Then there's Bill Dotry, who's like, I think the, the soft, lovable one. Ooh, that's close. What the heck? Who the flip wrote a no Kirby's allowed sign? Can I... You know what? I know exactly what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna burn that sucker. No Kirby's allowed. I got a trick for you. Uh, there we go. No Kirby's... That was a thing? That was a thing. Oh, no. I have done... I gotta be that, like, observant? I only did that for a joke. I didn't think it was gonna do anything. Actually, I thought it'd probably make... If it was gonna do anything, I thought it'd give me coins or something. Ah, right, crap. I gotta really pay attention to this game. All right. Well, I was lucky, I guess. Uh, Built O Tree uh, is like the lovable one. I don't really know how to describe him other than like, how do I get over here? I think the only way I can describe him is uh, he's just a good natured person, even if he's kind of sweaty. And I do know that he, uh, I don't know his voice actor's name, but I know he was the guy from Dodgeball, uh, who was Peter LaFleur's friend. Yes. In case you didn't know that, in case anybody's watched the movie Dodgeball. <laughs> in case anybody's watched the movie Dodgeball, I'm pretty sure his friend, the guy that wears the giant coat glasses, uh, who's all like, get mean, get angry, and he's like the lovable nice one, uh, who has his like, wife cheated on him and stuff. I'm pretty sure he's the actual like voice person for, uh, ooh, coins, thanks, uh, the actual voice person for uh, Bildo Tree. Uh, but the person I'm talking about is... The character who don't don't tang like this man, we all float down here, man. Mm. Uh, his name's Boomhauer. I don't know his full name, but his name's Boomhauer. He's like this like uh, I don't describe his hair. He's got like blondish hair, sandy blonde hair. Ah, I jumped right into that like a goober. I don't know why I even did that. That was so dumb of me, V. Come on. Um, he talks really fast. He talks like those like auctioneers that like uh you go to like swap meets or stuff and you're like. Oh, all right. Can we hear 25, 25, 25, 25? Can we hear 30, 30, 30, 30? Can we hear 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, uh, Eminem's uh, album, uh, thing of Rap God, and I'll find the video. I, I saved it. I'll find the video, and I'll put it uh, on my Discord, in case viewers don't want to wait that long, or just whatever. Oh, I crushed this thing. Tortorner? Tortorner? Tortorner has a whole shell made of concrete, as if it walked off with somebody's sidewalk. It has a thick skull and a mean bite, but its body's pretty delicate. A mouth mode ability might help you crack through its shell and land a brutal blow from above. Yeah, I did that last time. Oh, they'll capture Waldies! Uh, one of the Waldies being held captive by a fearsome East Bay. There are so many out there waiting to be saved. You can almost hear them calling for out. Wawa, Wawa. You know, like the, the, the chain of gasoline and grocery store, uh, the, the weird gasoline stores that also sell snacks that you drive through. They have actually somewhat all right foods. Uh, it's actually pretty decent. I wish this video was sponsored by Wawa. Uh, let me out, let me out. Wait, you hear that too? One of them must be nearby. I'll take a sponsor for Wawa. Uh, but yeah, if I can find that video, I will definitely post the link on Discord. YouTube, if you don't want to wait that long, uh, then you'll probably like look it up yourselves. But yeah, I'm going to give it a check out. Alright, that's all 10. I still don't have enough to like get anything crazy, so I think I'll just wait and just keep doing other levels. Unless whatever that is. Or that is? Hey, yeah, uh, oh, uh, Kirby, uh, those wild thieves you say found a new mysterious area called Treasure Road. Uh, it's where you're gonna find some loot, because, you know, it's a treasure. It, it, it kind of makes sense. It could be ray items in there. Hop and explore. All right, say less. Yeah, that's enough for me. Utter treasure? Bomb treasure? Uh, well, this one's here, so I'll do cutter treasure. Difficulty, one star. Uh, oh, I have to... Am I timed on this? Oh, I have to do it in a minute? Oh, it's a time challenge? Alright, well... Oh, and it turns... Oh, I get it. The treasure road, I have to be those modes. Okay, okay. So I have to be cutter for this. 
All right, I gotta do it in a minute. Let's do it. Uh, oh, that's kind of neat. I didn't even know I could do that. Oh, they might be kind of helpful, like, tell me how to, like, use these abilities. Oh, maybe that's why the game didn't, like, tell me how to, like, do things. Because it's like, oh, well, uh, it's funny you say that because you got a treasure road that will, like, teach you how to do it. I'm assuming. Whoa. Uh, uh, I need this. Give me. Gotta hurry up. Uh. Give me that. Uh. Oh, we'll go. Is this the thing that... Is that why? These things activate this thing? Okay, yeah. Those pieces activate it. Got it. Makes sense. I can just rapid fire these suckers. Ugh. Just. Ugh. Oh, go, go, go. Ow. Whatever. How much time do I have? Don't screw you, noobs. Go the goal. Unless I had to beat the enemies. Do I have to beat all the enemies? Oh, no. I just be quick? Okay, got it. So, these treasure roads, I just gotta be quick. I can do this. Which means I gotta probably do the same thing for Bomb. Alright, yeah. I'll do it. Yeah, this is dope. I don't know what that star thingy is. What is this thing? Some sort of star crystal thing. Crystal <gasps> stars? Uh, anything over there? No? Alright. Uh, let's see here. Uh, bomb treasure. Triple strike. Bowling for switches. I gotta do it in 30 seconds. Yeah, I'm sure I'll be able to do this. Well, it's one star, right? So I'm guessing one star easy. I wonder how many stars there are. And how difficult it'll be. Ugh. Ugh. Go, go, go. Gotta be quick. Gotta do it in 30 seconds. Try to fire a bunch of bombs. Get out of my way. Gotta be quick. Gotta be quick. Oh, missed. I feel like I just spam bomb. Oh, I should be smart about it. Uh oh. Go. Uh, uh. Oh, screw you guys. Uh. I don't have time. Well, I guess I don't need to beat all the enemies. I just need to get to the goal in time. Man, I'm cutting it close. I need to be faster than this, V. Come on, I can do the faster than that. I mean, I could, but... I mean, if I got a victory, I got a victory. What are these star rare stones? What are these rare stones? I'm certain the game will tell me. Any more treasure thingies? No? Okay. Uh, what do we got next? Rocky Rolling Road? Alright. Going in. I'll go back to Waldy Town once I get, like, more of the, uh, Waldies. I think it's more appropriate instead of just having to go. I see you. Oh, I don't kill... I don't keep the mode that I was in. I don't keep bomb. Alright. I guess when I enter the treasure road, I only just... Only for the treasure itself. I don't actually keep the mode. Oh. Uh-oh. Uh... Burn. Phew. I was I don't know how I survived that. Alright, let's find out what secret objective I have to do. I haven't discovered it yet. Hot flowers? No. Burn all the grass? No. He forced things. Oh, are you a new enemy? You might be a new enemy. Oh Ranger Kirby. I don't know if Ranger Kirby exists. There's so many Kirby abilities that I might be wrong on this, but that's why I'm going to bank on other poly people that have better memory right now. I don't know if there's a ranger mode before. Eat snacks off three uh, tree stumps. One out of three. You got to be careful where you're eating those, getting those from. You have no idea where it's been, Kirby. And again, uh, it's probably good for you. Also, do you ever, like, wipe your mouth whenever you eat, Kirby? You, uh, you left a bit of a mess. And Kirby just says, oh, yeah. That counts as a snack? All right, easy. Oh, I see what's called Rock and Roll and Road. I oh. Ooh, okay. Oh, uh, that's way better. I'm going to just make a habit of just mash buttons and see what every ability does for myself. I don't know if the Treasure Road, like, helps. Uh, or... Oh, I was about to do something stupid. 
And I, I like being able to aim this. Kind of fun. Whoa! But it might be nice to like try and like figure out how Kirby abilities work for myself. Fire. Oh. Uh... Yeah, I figured it out myself. I appreciate it though, game. I should make uh, jokes about it. It's probably for like people who don't know and aren't doing how I'm doing this, which is you know it's not all that bad. But I also think this video might be a little longer than normal ones. Not too much longer. But I think it's going to be very pleasant and just joyous. Gotta time this right. Uh, excuse me. Was it a snack? No. Oh. Those things reveal paths and stuff. Barely see. I'll take no damage. I'm going to pull this off perfectly. Oh, hello, secret path. Find the side road while going uphill. Uh, uh. I meant to do that, of course. Oh, that doesn't count? Oh, that was a tree stump. Was this really the purpose of Dome Mouth? Just to, like, pop open things? I guess so. Oh, another castle with a collection. Uh, is there anything worth going back? Probably not, right? Now nah, let's just assume. Well, if need be, I can probably just go back here. Whee! I'm gonna assume I got what I need to get. How are these rocks coming about here? Who's doing this? Oh, no, you don't. Go away. Oh, hello. Uh. Flawless. They say I'm a professional marksman. You know the anime World's Finest Assassin? Yeah, well, allow me to meet Kirby, the one that even beats him to shame. Oh, okay, so I unlock Ranger. Cool. Got it. Okay, I can't be Super Ranger or something. Uh. Oh, I gotta, like, shoot these quick. Got it. Ugh. That was easy. Gimme. That wasn't that bad. That was pretty easy. Well, it's probably easy because of the first... Oh, there's a headlamp! I just noticed it. Uh, It's probably easy because of the first area. It's probably gonna be one of those states where it's like, Oh yeah, Kirby's easy! I'm saying it right now. I know viewers are gonna be like, Oh, he thinks it's easy. Just wait until he like, gets to like, world... Well, I don't know. Kirby games usually have, what, like, eight worlds? Or such? I don't know if it will be eight worlds in this game or something. Six worlds? I don't remember how many worlds Kirby normally has. Yoink! That's snack? Okay, cool. That counts as snack. I don't know if, uh... How many worlds this game would have. I don't... Why is this angled like this? Why is it angled like this? Oh, God! That's why it's angled like this. Run! Run with your spindly little legs! I know you don't have knees! Kirby doesn't have knees. Uh, uh, excuse me. Uh, you guys should run for your lives. Uh, 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 uh. What'd I do? I hit a switch. Okay, cool. Come to me. Oh, I had to be quick. Look, in the, the slow motion. Oh, well, it's gone now. It was just showing, uh, the thing getting destroyed, so I had to be quick. There wouldn't be anything down there, would it? I don't... You know what? No harm, no foul. Ow! Okay, that just does damage. Got it. I noticed there's no lives in this game. Wonder how that's gonna work if I, like, die. Oh, well, try my best not to. Aw, oh, little cute can. I'll try my best not to die. I also need some food. Oh. Ah, oh, uh, Ranger mode's alright. I'm more of a bomb guy. Oh, uh, is it another closer thing? Need that. No? Okay. Oh, but I can go cur- uh, cur mode. Car mode! Turn to Kabi again. I- I love these little hats. I, they're just so cute. But yeah, I don't know, viewers. Is Ranger mode known? Like, I think it's new. I don't remember Ranger mode ever being a thing. Oh, I don't remember ever Ranger mode ever being a thing in the other Kirby games. Ah! Took damage from something? I think I did. Whee! Oh, hello, thing in there. <laughs> uh, got it. Oh, that's the last one of those. Are you okay in this mode? I, I assume Kirby's okay. Whenever I do these mouthful things, because 
I don't know, it, it looks painful. And so unsanitary. Ugh. But it's still fun. Uh, no. You know what? No regrets. No stopping. Can't see. Oh. Actually, well, that wasn't that bad. Alright. Drive without falling off the edge. Sure. Oh, you know what? I didn't even think about, like, me missing one. That really was lucky. I didn't even pay attention. I gotta... Okay, viewers, let's try to keep this in the memory. Uh, before we get to the gate, or whatever the cage thingy, uh, let's every now and then check and make sure, because these are apparently secrets that, if I'm not careful, I might miss out on. Granted, I could probably just come back for it, but if I don't have to, I don't want to. But yeah, I think Rager mode's new. I wonder what the new modes they'll be. What I always like... Oh, seriously, they're so cute. What I always like about Kirby games is that they always at least introduce one new power. But I wonder if we're going to get any pre-existing modes. Like, there's so many Kirby abilities. There's Wheel, and uh, Beam, and Cutter. Uh, there's so many, it's ridiculous. Is there a Kibble? Oh, no information? Oh yeah, what is this? Buffahorn. Behold. Oh, <clears throat> behold. I think from here on out, I'm just going to have Ethelin's voice do it. It's the brutal, brutish Buffalo, uh, Buffahorn. Uh, weak attacks won't stand a chance against this critter's forward tackle. Uh, and there's a reason why it was always picked first bit for the uh, uh, the bulls. Uh, good thing they have a hard time stopping. Uh, if you're careful, you can trick them into running off cliffs. They'll, they'll be okay down there. Uh, they're real tough. Uh, also, apparently this one in particular was uh, really good at being both the QB for uh, the New England Patriots. Until he ended up eating a little bit too much and they ended up having to let him go because his budget was too high. The budget? Yeah, he he ate a lot of food, and even the New England Patriots couldn't afford to keep him around. Shame on him. He should really, like, be more sparing here. What do you think? One more trip to Alivel Mall? Alivel Mall? Olivel Mall? I don't know what that is. Rock and Roll Road? Sweet. Oh, and a treasure road. Alright. Two treasure roads. Oh, okay. This isn't anything? Oh, this is something. It looks suspicious. They found a hidden port of treasure road. Let's see what's inside. The reason why is because they have the butterflies out around here. This looked like an open spell. Cone mouth treasure three stars? Oh, that's going to be difficult then, right? How difficult is three stars? You know what? Let me see the other ones first. Uh, let's see. We got fire. Ranger. Ooh, ranger's two stars. I don't know, like, how many stars... Like, juristic difficulty. Also, can I go further here? Oh, oh. what I do? Oh, press B to return. Oh, that lets me go right back to Waldy Town? Alright, cool. Um, I'll just do the fire ones quicker. Fast and fiery race to the cannon. Gotta do it in 45 seconds. I got this. I could totally do this, right? You are sending your energy for Kirby. Oh, okay. I just gotta do that. Go! Oh, time doesn't go... Okay, time doesn't go when I, uh... Um... Go into the cannon, I think. And I can speed it up by holding down. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Get out my way. Ow! Get out my way! Go, go, go! Yeah, I can speed it up by holding... I speed it up by, like, going fully into the canyon. Canyon. The cannon. I was about to say, if this game made the time cap going despite me being in a cannon... Ooh, that was quick. Oh, man, I'm awesome. Uh, that time uh, kept going while I was still in the cannon. I would have called shenanigans on that jazz. On that jazz. Beep, 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 beep. Yeah, this is really doing good. Yeah, okay. I think it's good enough in the video. I won't give too much of my personal thing, because I know some people probably like, whatever. Because I know somebody's like, if and, oh, I gotta do it in a minute. Somebody's probably like, oh, B, what was the uh, ready, aim, fire, distant targets? Why are you in a bad mood? Like I said, it was just, oh, my ranger. There's just a number of things just happened today. Like, it it was small things at first, and it just was just constant bad things happening. I'll be quick. I can talk and do this, right? Yeah, I'm a content creator. <laughs> this help whoa okay uh but it was like when i got up today oh 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 i, I think i got the shot off uh. Uh. 
uh, like I got up today, it was like really hot, really sweaty. Um, the first thing that happened was I uh, knocked over into my Switch. Uh, I had to get new Joy-Cons because, ah, uh, I don't waste my time with you guys. Okay, I got the shot off. Ow. Ow. Go already. I don't care about these book enemies. Don't care. Don't care. Wish I was faster. Um, yeah, so I I woke up and I found that I accidentally like oh phew. I fell and knocked into my uh Joy-Con or my Switch, uh, which I have on my tray uh, on my uh table here, which I don't know why I'm gesturing like you guys can see it. But I have a table next to my uh bedside here. Um that I usually just put a lot of stuff in. Great, I need to be a lot more cleanlier here. Um and it was one of those things where uh I knocked into it when I woke up because I heard the sound of a crunch. And not not like crunch, but the sound of like something breaking apart, and I it I felt its effect more than I heard its effect. So of course it would like got me up because I also felt like something like kind of like stabbed me. And I was like, ah, what was that? So I checked it out and I landed on my Joy-Con, but I guess I like rammed right into it, so it just hurt the crap out of me. It wasn't that bad. Hello, Bayo. Jumped in saying October first is gonna be a big day for me. You have to let me know why. Uh Bayo, for those who don't know, jumped on chat. Also curious why you said October 1st is going to be a big day for you. Uh, burst and rise, a path full of pipes. Three stars. wonder how many stars... Like, is there four? It looks like there's room for, like, a fourth one. So, what is this, like, second to hardest? I guess we'll find out. I gotta do it in 45 seconds. Um, but yeah, my day started with me, like... I guess woke, waking up to my Switch just being, like, on me. Or under me, I guess. Oh, I gotta be quick. Okay, got it. Um, and I had to get new Joy-Cons. And that's usually never fun. Like, people have to, like, go... Oh, I gotta do that. Don't have time for this. Uh, having to, like... Whee! Buy new Joy-Cons. It, it was on me. I get it. But it was still just kind of sucky, because I don't really want to be, obviously, spending all my money on replacement things. But that was on me. And no, before anyone asked, I didn't get any, like, insurance. I should have. But it, uh, I was just, I, I didn't think about it at the time. So that was my first thing. Uh, ah! Uh, oh. Get out of my way, guys. Uh, uh. Ooh, okay, phew. Um, but it started with that, and I was like, oh, ow! Uh, Bale says, October 1st, pretty much home my home park opened a new coaster yesterday, and that's the day I can first ride it. No! I was off by a second! Oh, I gotta redo this. Crap, I gotta do it again. Dang it. It's because I probably took damage. That's not hard, but I could do it. I can totally beat the time. I'm gonna try it again. I know how to do it. Uh, so your home park has a coaster, huh? You have to let me know. I'll talk about coasters in a quick second. Um, but yeah, it started with me just having to like go to my local game store and like getting a new uh, pair of Joy-Cons. Um... Which wasn't, you know, in retrospect, all that bad. But the other thing that happened was uh, when I went to the game store, uh, their first issue they had was they were having technical difficulties. Um, so they were only having, like... The game store that I go to has, like, a bunch of registers. Uh, but I guess the main register... or the They had, like, a couple. Like, I don't know if they had, like, more than two. I think they only had the two. They have, like, one close to the door, one to the end. Go, 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 go. Oh, I'm dead. Oh, I messed up. Can I restart? I can try again. Okay, cool. Oop, uh. How do we do that? Bayo says, and also it has also the first in the U.S. with a first tilt track in the U.S. and a drop track? Oh, God. I don't, I don't know how I feel about that. Especially since Bayo, I'm pretty sure you're aware about my whole thing on heights. But I'll, I'll discuss that in a quick second. Um, but yeah, uh... So one of the registers wasn't working, so then I had the other register to, like, get by. And I'm not really, like, too caring, because, you know, technical difficulties, it's whatever. But by the time I went, it was, like, super busy. And I didn't realize it was going to be so busy when I went. Like, it was a nice, like, calm period. Ugh. Go, go, go. I don't have time. Ugh. Am I going to make it in 45 seconds? Ugh. Go, go, go. Hope I do. Ugh. Did I make it? Was that quick? I don't get more rare four thingies. Oh, phew! Okay, I was a little quicker that time. Sweet beans. 
Even though it's just worth points, but hey, I'll still take it. Um, but yo, you know I'm terrified of heights, so I don't know. I mean, I'm still curious, so please tell me more. But at the same time, I'm going to just be honest. I don't have... I'm not saying this in a negative means I don't have interest, but more like because of fear, I don't want to have an interest. Uh, Bayo says, except for the lift hill and first helix, it's all indoors, so you can't see how high you are. That's even more worrying. Well, I don't know. Maybe it is not that worrying compared to it, but surely once you go on the coaster, you're going to feel the feeling of gravity like going against you as you're rising. And I know my stupid mindset. It's going to be one of those things where I'm going to like be thinking, wow, I'm st we're still climbing up and up and up and up. When are we going back down? Like, I don't mind fast rides uh, and comfortable rides, but any super high rides, loopy loops? Nah, screw that noise. That is not my thing. You're gonna have to pay me if you want to consider me to consider that. I know somebody's like, maybe he's faking. No, dead serious. You can pay me a thousand dollars. Wouldn't do it. This is cute. Wonder why it's called a level olive oil mall. Hmm, whatever. Um, but yeah, that was the second thing was like they were having technical difficulties, and I mean it was is what it is. It wasn't that bad, and it was like super busy. But I was like, uh, well I can't. Oh, wait, are you an enemy? Oh, oh, come here. It. It me weird. B thing. Oh. Oh, needle's back. Okay. Ooh. And that's kind of feels similar to old uh, Kirby games. Um. Oh, I can pick these up. Oh, I can throw them too. Ooh. Kind of neat. Can't pick up things that are built in there, but all right. Uh. What was I saying? Oh, but uh. I was, your coaster thing, Bayo, is really, like, throwing me steez off. Um, but yeah, then it was the thing where I was like, okay, let me go get, uh, can I ask for a pair of Joy-Cons? And they were like, oh, yeah, sure, what color would you like? And I was like, oh, well, I don't really mind. Uh, give me red and blue. And they were like, oh, we're sorry. Like, the person at first was like, was like red and blue coming up. And then the other clerk, uh, the it was a woman that was helping me um, when I went. And the guy, because there was another guy that was there. Uh, I guess a co-worker and uh, he was like oh we're actually out of the red and blue ones and she's like oh I'm so sorry and I was like oh no no it's all good it's all good and then she offered me what she described were the pink lemonade colors which is like this like pink and like yellow and I was like oh this actually looks kind of cute let me do that I'll try the pink lemonade plus I like the name of it um, and she was like okay let me double check but just in case uh, there's also the she referred to the colors as the Watermelon or Cosmo and Wando for Fairly Out Parents, pink and green. She had the pink lemonade, and then she said she had red and blue. And then she said uh, we had gray. I was like, all right, cool. Uh, well, I'll go for the pink lemonade because I like pink lemonade. Sounds pleasant. And then uh, we'll go from there. And uh, she went to like her back like storage inventory thingy, whatever it is, her back inventory uh, room. Um, I was like, all right, cool. And then I'll just get some Joy-Cons. Uh, then came to the issue where I was waiting for a good minute. Uh, this is also a good moment to mention, uh, not to add more insult to injury, but, ooh, hello, capsule. Uh, the AC is busted, so that was always a thing. I, I didn't jump fast enough. The AC was busted. Now, they had fans, so it wasn't that bad, but it was whatever. I, I don't really mind that, except for the fact that I don't do hot weather, but that's, for the most part, whatever. Eat four donuts? That's what I have to do here? Hmm. Oh, uh, Bayo's got back to me on that roller coaster. Uh, he said, For the most part, it's more of a dark ride than a coaster. The only real coaster elements, from what I know, are a few helixes and the endings. I mean... I wouldn't mind trying it if it wasn't, like, a super high... Like, it's super high... Oh, the, the candy. The Invincible candy? That's classic for Kirby. Oh, hold on. Gotta go. Eat Invincible candy. And I'm away! I'm invincible! Ugh. Wait, this music. Wait, hold on. Oh, it's muted. Uh, it's lower. Hold on, I gotta turn this music up. Ah! Oh. Yo, who decided to pay Kirby, uh... Who made guitar Kirby? This is hype. This is hype. Okay, let me turn it down just in case Nintendo tries to, like, uh, be like, Hey, you can't do that. Sorry, Nintendo. I wish it lasted longer. Oh, well. Uh, alright, I gotta find more visibility candies. Um, I would try it, but I, again, it's, it's the worry because maybe it might be because I can't see Bayo, 
that my fear will kick in and I'll, it'll make it think that it's way higher for me. It may not even be. Oh, there's nothing out there. It may not even be, but my worry is like, oh, it might be worse that I can't see it coming because then my mind's going to play tricks on me. It was like, oh, well, uh, you can't see death coming. So for all I know, we could go through like like 90 like corkscrews and loop-de-loops or something. I don't know. I'm not assuming it's actually dark, dark, but I'm just saying like not being able to see may not be all as good as it is. This is mouthful. Oh, what is this? The what is this? Storage mouth? Really? Oh, uh oh. Uh oh. This is really the mouthful mode. Wow. Does it say burger to right? Oh yeah, I like a burger. I'm hungry. I'll definitely go for a burger. Oh, 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 it's a map to tell me where I need to go. So I want to go for the burger path. But what happens if I go for the ice cream or the... Omelette? Rice? What is that in the distance? Oh. Actually, you know what? I'm lazy. Oh! Okay, phew. Excuse me, everybody. Uh, gentlemen. Ladies. Hello. Nice to meet you. Hello. Uh... So, to, to continue on and uh, try to, like, wrap up my these very good, uh, uh, no good, very bad day-ish kind of thing. I'll, I'll do the burger, whatever. Um, I don't know what the point of it was. Alright, I'm in the burger path. Ooh. Thanks. You didn't need that, right? Ooh. Thank you. Wish I could have that for me. Um, but she went to the back, and she came back, and... I can already tell I wasn't going to be happy with the news because at first she was all like sing-songy and happy and I'll admit she was cute. Uh, but she was all like sing-songy hello, sing -songy and happy. And I was like, oh, it's probably going to lead to something good. Uh, when she left, of course. She was like all happy. She's like, oh, don't worry, sir. I'll be right back. Uh, but what found out to my surprise was she came back with like this most like, kind of like a, ooh, like, I don't know how to better describe it. Like if you say the sound, ooh, that's what uh, the sound effect is. Or the sound effect. That's how she made the face. Do I need fire or sword? Do I want any of these viewers? Oh, or needle? Um, you know what? I kind of dig fire. I'll choose fire. Uh, she came back. She was like, "I'm so sorry, sir." And I was like, "Oh, what's the matter?" Wild Frosty. Hey, Frosty, you look different than I remember. You look a little hairier than I remembered. Burn, 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 burn. Just stand here and do this. That's nice. Burn, burn, burn. Oh, it leaves ice trails. Ugh. Whoa! Ah! You take extra damage because you're. Uh, get away from me! Get away! Get away! Get away! Oh, okay. I will take your power though, because I know you're gonna be ice, because you're always ice. Ice Kirby. Oh, and I'm ice skating! Oh, and I do a little, like, one of the little twirl jump things. Pirouettes? That's so cool. Uh, Bale says, it's pretty dark from what I've heard, uh, but you're more focused on the screen since it's interactive. I'll show you the POV. Are oh, you gonna send it to me on Discord? Alright, I'll I'll check it out. Well, I don't know if you're gonna send me on Discord. Alright, I mean, I'm still gonna check it out. Obviously not the right, but I am curious. I wouldn't be saying it otherwise. Oh, this is actually a little hard to control, uh, viewers. This little ice power of mine. I'm gonna let it shine. Uh, what I will say is, she came back, she looked upset, I was like, oh, I'm not gonna like it. And she immediately hit me with the, sir, I'm so sorry. Uh, and I, I, my immediate response was, oh, you don't have the pink lemonade? It's fine. She's like, actually, we ran out of Joy-Cons. I was like, what? I was, I was bummed, yes, but it is what it is. Uh, where did that come from? Is anything else up here? Oh, no? all right, well, whatever. Uh, and naturally, you're probably like, oh, well, justify why you're upset. I wasn't holding it against her. Nothing on her part. She probably didn't know. At least I will tell myself that. Uh, uh, but eventually I was like, well, okay, then I'll just uh, try my chances at a different game store. Because there's another one. Granted, it's an old, like, old-timey game store, so it's different from the ordinary one that I go to. Ugh, break it easy. Sweet, capsule. Um, anything else? No? Okay. 
uh, she's like, oh, no, no, well, actually, if you want to, like, wait out, we can, we're actually having our delivery, uh, from, uh, the delivery company that will come by and, like, give us things. They said there was some in transit, so if you want to wait it out, it'll be fine. I was like, oh, okay, that doesn't sound too bad. Uh, why not? I'll, I'll wait it out. How long would it be? Uh, just, uh, uh, uh how long would it be? She was like, well, we usually get, like, our shipments around, like, uh, like, close to, uh, well, okay, so, to help bring the context of this. Oh, get this coin. You know what? Be smart, B. There we go. Uh, for context, uh, I'm over in the West Coast. By the time I went there, like I got out of my place uh, and we went there. Uh oh. Uh, okay, phew. Uh, by the time we, uh, I, we, I got there, it was like close to like one in the afternoon. Uh, I didn't get a chance to go earlier. I wanted to, but uh, I just didn't. It wasn't happening. Uh, Bale says, just sent the POV, so that's in the server. Okay, once I'm done with this episode, I'll totally check it. And I'll definitely send, on Discord, my completely unfiltered response. There's a lot of enemies over there. Wait, hold on. Evil candy, eat four donuts. I need two more, but I didn't find the, the hidden thing. Uh-oh, that worries me a little bit. Hope I, uh, find it. Um, yeah, I'll definitely check it out. Uh, ooh, hello. Oh. Uh, looks like shortcake left. Hold on, there's more goodies over here. Oh, 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 hello. And see you. Look, secret pathway. Ooh, what you got in here? Oh, ice cream. What am I supposed to make with that? Ice cream. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Okay, hold, hold on, hold on. That's the corner to this, right? So the shortcake path looks like it's where I need to go, but if I'm understanding, there's something to the ice cream path? Guess I'll try it. I don't know. Well, no, nothing venture, nothing gain. Whee! I love that I can just little, these little jumps. They're so pretty. Where's the green ice cream? I want to find the ice cream. For all you losers, all I care about is ice cream. Freeze you guys. Ow! Wow, that really was a critical hit. Alright. Um, so, like I said, we went there around like 1. And I was like, okay, cool. I'll just like wait here and uh, I'll just chill. Or I'll go to like some local spot. Because there's like a fast food spot. Uh, nearby. Oh, uh oh. Oh. That might have been a bad idea. Um. There was a McDonald's uh, over there. Uh-oh. Ah! Go away. That's handy. Oh, I gotta get rid of you guys using the enemies. Eh. Oh, wait. Ooh, hold on. I got new abilities? Oh, if I mash B, I do that. That's it? Just beating the enemies? That Nothing happened? Alright, whatever. Um, so I went, I, I got a couple of burgers from McDonald's, I just, like, had lunch. I was like, alright, I'll just, like, chill out, wait for it. Uh, uh, oh, sorry, I didn't say. They said they would get it here around, like, 2, so I was like, an hour or something. Alright, well, I mean, it's a good distance from my place, my apartment. I was like, I'll just, like, chill out and, uh, wait it out. By the time I, like, you know, get McDonald's, I can watch some anime, just chill out. Because I, I usually bring, like, my anime station with me to, like, watch portable Blu-rays. A portable DVD uh, Blu-ray player. Um, so I was like, oh, I'll just chill out and uh, wait out. And around 2, I mean, I know, obviously, right? Like, there's no way it'll get here immediately. There might be some delays. I'm aware of that. But I guess my expectation was like, oh, well, I'll just, do whoa. I'll just double check, make sure. And, uh, yeah, unfortunately, um, this looks important. Oh. Wait, what am I... Oh, 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 I'm breaking the whole thing down. Whoa, Kirby. Uh. Well, that was one way to do it, Kirby. Oh, wait, is that the gold thing? Oh, no, maybe I should have went the other way. What was the point of the ice cream, then? There was nothing for the ice cream. I missed some stuff. Oh, well, I'll just have to replay the level. Um, so it was, like, closer to 2. Granted, it was, like, 2.15. Like around that point that I was like, all right, surely 
They can hopefully have the deliveries, and I'll go uh, nab this thing. Oh, is that all of them? No, I missed a donut. Yeah, I'll have to replay this level, folks. Oh, this is what it is. Might as well get this, and then I'll just probably replay the level. Um, but yeah, it was around like two, like two fifteen, like I said. I went back, and he was like, "Oh, you're back," and I was like, "Yeah." Uh, are the Joy Cons here? Navigate the mall without getting lost. Oh, oh, wait, did they tell me? Oh, that's kind of neat for them to tell me. All right, this is where you messed up, so do it again, but better. Okay, so I need to eat a donut and then not get lost. That's why they have the pathway. So then what was the point of the ice cream then? To get lost, I bet. Go, oh, Mal. Kirby gained the mystery. Oh, Kirby gained the mysterious mouthful mode ability after he flew through the vortex. Now he can stuff an entire dome into his mouth. Wrap around one of these and twist till it pops open. If there's any good inside, I'm gonna find out. Good old Gordo, Eddie Gordo. Um, and she recognized obviously because I was there like about an hour ago. I was like, "Hey, are the Joy Cons uh, in?" And she was like, "No, I'm sorry, they haven't gotten here yet. Uh, we thought it'd be here by now, but we're actually sending an email to wonder what's going on because they usually are consistent." And I was all like, "No, no, it's all good. Like, it's not that big a deal." Oh, that's not the cutest thing. The brawl at the mall? Is that a giant gorilla? It kind of looks like the silhouette. Hey, uh, the Wildies, they open you open the gate, blocking your way. You can go on the stage and challenge the boss. Uh, you gotta do it. I'm pretty sure it's Donkey Kong. Oh, and another treasure road thingy? Okay, well, I'm gonna go back to Oliver Mall. Okay, so I need to find one more Wildy, eat four donuts, and not get lost. So I'm just gonna go straight to where the game tells me to go. Um... So I ended up waiting like another like 30 some minutes and it wasn't the worst, like I said, but it was just still like, oh, well, that, that really kind of bites. Um, and eventually the FedEx came or their FedEx like company people came in because I know it was FedEx that had a FedEx truck. I was like, all right, cool. Uh, sweet beans. Let me get the Joy-Cons. Well, I didn't say it like that in case any viewers are like, oh, did you just demand Joy-Cons like that? V? You don't own the place. No, no, no. I did ask. Uh, well, afterwards, I waited. I waited patiently. I'm not going to just be like impatient or anything. Plus, she was already on the whole, like, let me go get Joy-Cons for you. Assuming there were Joy-Cons in there. Um, in the boxes they get. I don't know how they usually do their boxes, but whatever. Not my point to tell. Doink. Gotta look out for donuts. Gotta look out for donuts. Um, I'll keep ice, too, just in case I need it. I don't think I do, but no harm, no foul. Okay, so that's the first one. Gotta find. Oh, it resets? Okay, I guess it makes sense. I'm just gonna get this invincible cannon and get going. Is there anything up here? Oh, I'm way faster, too. I don't remember. Was there anything up here that I needed? And points? I don't think so. Um, so I ended up waiting 30 minutes, uh, like I said, and then they went and grabbed the. Oh, they only get points. Uh, and I was like, oh, they finally gave me the Joy Con? Or are the Joy Cons finally in there? Uh, they weren't. Um, and she was just like. It was one of those things where she felt bad but didn't know what to say, and I was like, you know what, it's it's all good, it's it's not a big deal. I'll just, like, work with what I got, with, which is the Pro Control I have right now. Um, so, end all be all, I still didn't get uh, Joy-Cons uh, from there, so I was I was bummed, but it wasn't the worst. Like, I, I knew eventually I would get Joy-Cons, um, but it was still just kind of upsetting because I was like, oh, well, I guess I'll just have to wait until I, like, wait until later to get them. But, uh, I was impatient, so after, like, a good hour, I convinced my folks to, like, drop me off. Uh, because we were planning on going to, like, a nearby mall, and I knew the mall had, like, a game store anyway. So, when we were heading over to the mall, uh, I was like, alright, I'll catch up with you guys later. I gotta go check out, uh, the game store in the mall, see if they have Joy-Cons. Um, because I really need them, obviously. Gotta be on the lookout for more donuts. Um, I don't know where they be. If I retrace my steps, I I know I'll at least get three. It's probably that one path with the when I went the wrong way, right? I bet it is. Whee! Also, I'm gonna do fire again. I wonder if fire does more damage against ice. You know, elements, taking Pokemon, taking portals. I knew you were gonna come back. Burn, 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 burn. Nope. Burn, burn, please. Um. And they did have a game store, uh, and I was like, I wonder if they have it. And 
yes, viewers, they did have Joy-Cons. Uh, they were just like these normal like red and green ones. And I was like, you know what? I'll take it. I know somebody's like, red and green ones? Yeah, no, it's literally red and green. Or, well, pink and green. The, not, I guess it's more pinkish than red. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Although they look red, like I'm looking at them now. Like I'm angling my, my heads to, uh, my heads. I'm multiple heads viewers. I'm angling uh, my vision down to look because I have the switch and the things stuck into it. The Splatoons? Uh, uh, no, they're just normal like pink and green. Like, I don't know if that is Splatoon, but they are pink and green. Uh, what that one would, what did the woman describe? Cosmo and Wanda from Fairly Out Parents? I like that. That's how uh, they look. Ow, I totally attacked you. <laughs> Radio point. Oh no, you're just coins. Um, but I have them now, so I got the new Joy Cons. It's all really good. Uh, of course, though, as you're probably wondering, you're like, oh, did you get like protection or warranty or something? Uh, well, I, they know they come with their own manufacturing warranty, so I'm not like too worried about that in that aspect. But God forbid I really need. Uh, freeze already. God forbid I need to actually have to use them, but whatever. At least I have new Joy Cons. That wasn't that bad. But what was bad was when I got to the mall after I got the Joy-Cons. So, uh, the mall I have is like a two-floor, like, thing. I don't I don't know how to describe it. I don't want to say two-story, but it's like two floors in their elevator. Um, can we... Okay, that's two. Uh, Bale says, I don't think there's an official name, but there's Splatoon ones. Oh, okay. I don't know. All I know is that they're pink and green. They're pinkish red green, like... I know they're pink, but they look like red down here. I don't know. They're probably more close to it. On the box, they were pink, but they also look red. I know they're not red red, because I know red, but... You know, whatever. No, no, no. They're just Joy-Cons. I got the Joy-Cons. Um, and... No, what happened was, like... So, we went... As I left the, the game store, I was like, alright, cool, sweet. Uh, I finally got Joy-Cons. It took a little longer than necessary. Um, not that I was worried, because I was planning on using... Uh, I was using uh, my Pro Controller anyway for streaming. Because originally I was planning on doing Master Detective Archives uh, today, which I'll probably end up just doing a little later. Um, I guess I don't need to go in here again, but whatever. Uh, seriously, so if short cake is that, then what's the point of the ice cream? I really don't know why this is it's just a red herring, I guess. It's just a trick me. Oh, whatever, I'll just do what it tells me to. Go to short cake? Let's go to the short cake. Um, there's a shortcake over here. Wait, there's two shortcakes. Oh, I get it. It wasn't a red herring. It was to use that to compare the map. So it's next to the ice cream. Got it. Oh, that makes so much sense. Okay, game. Never mind. You're right. So it's there, which means it's supposed to be the shortcake on the opposite street or the opposite pathway to uh, the ice cream. So it wasn't a red herring to trick me. It's this shortcake, because I was about to say, I'll just go to the closest one. It means this is the one I should go to. I think. Oh, yes, it was. You guys don't need these, right? Thanks. Thanks, thank, 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 thank you. Yeah, okay, got it, got it. And it's all four Waldies. I still need to find, um... I need to find the other donut, wherever that is. Okay. Oh, oh, well. Uh, speak the devil and ye shall appear. Now uh, the one's at the end. Okay, cool. Um, so like I said, the mall has like these two floors, like an upper floor and a, a bottom like level floor thingy, which is, you know, kind of odd. I don't, I think most malls usually have that. Maybe there's some that are three. I've been to one that has three actually, so I shouldn't say some as if I don't know. Um, but the mall closest to us has uh, a two story mall or two floor layout mall. Um, the game store is on the upper floor, and obviously I had to go back down. When I first went down there, it was through the escalator. Uh, so I went through the escalator. I kid you not. Okay, the best way I can describe it is... And I'm, I'm laughing about it right now. I guess I can, all I can do is laugh about it. So... This is not bad what I'm saying, per se. And I'm going to preface this by saying... Nothing really dramatically bad happened. I didn't think it was possible. Because I only saw it in this horror movie called Final Destination. But... If anybody knows the scene, I don't remember which Final Destination was. There's the scene where, uh, I guess somebody gets, like, their shoelaces, like, stuck in the little, like, connecting part of the escalator. Like, there's a part where it gets, like, sucked back into the ground. Uh, 
Yeah, so, fun fact, I, that's real. Uh, I thought it was just, you know, for the sake of the movie, but I guess, yes, and I know somebody out there is like, so you didn't tie your shoes. Yes, that was on me. I'm fair on that one. But it was still the issue where I did tie my shoes, and I was, like, stuck to, like, it wasn't that bad. It was just, like, wedged in something, and before someone's like, wait, are you okay? I'm completely fine. My shoes are completely fine. However, what wasn't completely fine was as I got stuck, I tripped. And as I was like trying to get up, I knocked into this like poor old lady and I felt so bad because it was like this old lady had like, there's like this like, uh, she, I don't know what she had, but it, something with like some sort of cream. I don't know if it was like some sort of like dipping sauce or something because she was just eating this little thing. Like she was walking like, okay, imagine how you will. I know some people, I'm pausing the purpose because I want you guys to get like an image of how this was. So imagine you're going uh, down on an escalator. Oh, excuse me. Uh, yeah, down on the escalator, right? And uh, there's like the down area has like a little food court spot. So I wasn't paying attention. I mean, I was listening to music. I use I was listening to Xenoblade Chronicles 3 music. That's neither here nor there. Uh, I was putting the Joy-Cons in my backpack and I was just like looking. I was like, oh, we got some time. Maybe I can grab something to eat. There's a food court like a little on the lower floor. And I was like, oh, right, yeah, I'll just like go check out, grab some like grub. Uh, just be like it what it is. Whatever. Just call it a day because it's been an eventful one. Um. I only noticed this because of last minute, but this old lady had like another like younger girl who I'm not gonna lie was really attractive. <laughs> like she was definitely within my strike zone for sure. I don't think I landed any kind of brownie points with me falling into what I presume to be her grandmother or her mother. Um, but I don't know what they were eating or if they were, they obviously were coming back from the food court because it's over to the left. Like if you go down the escalator, go a little bit up and to the left, there's like this whole food court with a bunch of like, like food spots and stuff, like little like kiosks or kiosks, like little like food vendors and everything. And I was going to go there to grab like a bite to eat. I'm still hungry. I eat a lot. I'm fat. Whatever. Sue me. Uh, but, oh, not really. But still, uh, when I went down there, my shoelace got stuck in the escalator bit and it wasn't bad to the point where it was like, it wasn't one of those Final Destination things where it's going to suck me up and kill me or anything. It wasn't that drastic. It was just stuck. And it was to the point where I was like, oh, I can't move. So without any proper thought, all I did was just give like a big old, Ugh! like a big old yank. And I guess I put, I, did, I it felt stuck to me, but I guess I overestimated like how stuck it was. Because it really wasn't in retrospect. I probably could have like used my hand and pulled, which would have been smarter. But I didn't. I was just in a state where I was just like, you know, I'm just going to just yank my foot. What's the worst that could happen? Well, the worst that was happened was like it threw me off and like misstepped. And I like, it was one of those things where I slipped on the edge of my shoe. Like I actually fell a little bit out of my shoe and I knocked at the old lady. So one, it was embarrassing because there was a lot of people at the mall. So clearly everyone saw this like tall dude, completely klutzy as hell, knocked this grandmother down in front of this really hot girl, which I'm assuming because they were together is probably her granddaughter. Clearly, I'm not going to get any brownie points on that. And she had this like icing thing that like knocked it to her. And first, as you probably imagine, you're like, oh, that's so bad. And yes, I'm a generally nice human being. So I was like, oh, no, 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 I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. And the girl was like, the grandmother was like sweet about it. She was like, oh, it's okay, dear. Accidents happen. I kid you not. I've never had this happen to me before. I've never had a person give me like a death glare. Like, like I was dead to her. Like, cause the really hot girl just like glared at me. She looked daggers into me. Like, if she stared any harder, I felt like she was going to, like, blow me up with her eyes. Clearly, not only did I not have a chance, not like I was going to flirt with her or anything, because I'm an introvert, I'm shy, but that was one of those, like, if I even thought to look at her, it wasn't even going to, like, work well, because she was staring back. Like, yeah, she was, like, okay with me helping her up, but as I was, like, saying I apologize or anything, she was just, like, staring, like, intensely at me. And it was worse because I heard, like, some people, like, most people were just kind of, like, they were trying to offer help. This one, like, guy was, like, offering to help her out, too, as I was helping her. And, again, the grandmother was, like, super kind about it. She was like, oh, it's okay. Accidents happen. It's all good. But what sucked was, like, I heard, like, these, like, two kids. I don't know how old they are. They're, like, preteens or something. These kids are like, well, that guy, like, totally knocked down that grandma. And then I heard, like, this one kiss and, like, I guess, I don't know if it was, like, an older, like, brother or whatever. They were like, hey, don't point. And even though, what's worse, like, they were, like, saying, like, don't point. I could hear, like, the, somebody just, I don't know who. I don't know if it was one of those kids or someone else. But I heard someone go, like, mm -hmm. 
and it was just super embarrassing because like I knocked at this old lady again by accident and it was bad because she had like this like, icing stuff like on her shirt now and left like this weird like stain thing and she said it was okay and I was I was like over and over I was like I'm so sorry I'm so sorry let me let me treat you let me get you a new thing I don't know what it was and she was like no 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 it's okay she was saying like all these things to like comfort me she was saying like oh I didn't really have much of an appetite I don't eat that much it was all good I was gonna throw it away anyway and yeah, and then add insult to injury, the really hot granddaughter, I assume, unless it's not, doubt that she's gonna somehow be... Can you imagine? Like, the person or the people I'm talking about, they, like, are one of my followers or subscribers. Can you imagine? Sorry, I'm trying to cheer myself here. Uh, but I ended up, like, knocking down, and they were going their separate ways, and I was like, oh, I just felt, like, so embarrassed. I... I'm Like I said, I don't like being in the spotlight, but I just felt so embarrassed. And I was like, let me just... I just tried to like quite quick fast walk. I was like, let me just go get to the food court. They have like this like Wetzel's pretzels thing that's nearby, which might have been where they got it from. Or might the thing is because I know it was like some sort of like cream stuff because my hand touched it and it felt like kind of like stickyish, like smooth and sticky. So it might have been icing. Uh, but I was like, you know what? I'm gonna just go get me a Wetzel's pretzels. I really like their like sinful cinnamon pretzels. I love those pretzels, man. Wetzel's pretzels. If any of you people. Uh, want to hire a nice voice guy with an okay sense of humor? Hey, uh, help me out. But I went to Wetzel's Pretzels. I was like, oh, uh, I was like third in line. It wasn't that bad. I was like, oh, okay, can I get like a... I can play the game while I'm doing this. Sorry, I just had to rant on that one real quick. Oh, okay, cool. Um, I had to rant on that real quick. But yeah, I was like, what's the Pretzels? Like, oh, hey, can I... Uh, after my turn, I was like, hey, can I get the, the sinful cinnamon? I want the, uh, the, the little bit thingies, the cinnabits. That they call it the simple cinnamon bits or whatever i was like oh okay it'll just cheer me up i'll just get this hopefully i'll try to get the mindset of i'm not going to see these people because nobody pays attention to people hopefully at the mall unless something embarrassing like that happened so i was like okay i'll just like get this call it a day we'll be all good um yeah so you're you're probably thinking like okay clearly something else happened because otherwise you wouldn't be talking about this right yes you're right something else did happen they didn't have enough things to do the cinnamon bits i was like wait what how do you run out of Oh, Gavin, how do you run out, like, what, and I, I'll admit, I was a little flustered, so I did the one thing I probably shouldn't have, I was like, wait, huh, what do you mean you're out of, like, the Cinnabits, and then the person behind the, like, clerk guy, he was like, yeah, so we're actually, like, making more, like, pretzel, like, the actual, like, physical pretzels, because they didn't have, like, any pretzels, they were making pretzels, like, there, and I was, I was confused, because I was like, wait, do they not have, because they have, like, this little, like, kiosk thing, this little glass windowy thingy that I thought were pretzels, and the person was like, oh, no, no, that one's like a model, like not a not an edible pretzel. That one's a really stale one. We only use that to like advertise what the pretzels look like. So that one, the like pizza one, the plain one, they're not real. And I was like, OK, so and as you probably know, because I just dealt with this at the freaking game store for my Joy Cons, I was like, OK, so how long ice treasure? Oh, cool. Uh, freeze and fling skating on ice. So of course I'm like, all right, well, how long will it take to like get the puzzles? And she was like, oh, the guy was like, oh, it won't take too long. It's just like a couple minutes. So I was like, all right, cool. No worries. Uh, and I try to listen to music, but I will admit, oh, mash B. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The dash thingy. Whee! Oh, that's fun. It's really fun. Go, go, go. Oh, it's a little hard to control, though. It's really hard to control. I, I didn't really pay attention to what time I needed, but whatever. Go, 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 go. I'm actually be as fast as I can. Oh, that, oh that's gonna be fun. Get out of my freaking way. Hope I did the time. Uh, So I waited at the little, like, booker area. I was, like, just standing by this little, like, pillar thing. Okay, phew, sweet. I stood by this little, like, pillar thing. I was like, all right, cool. I'll just wait. It shouldn't take too long. And I see them, like, preparing it. Because they, they're like a really small like spot, so I can see them like baking their like pretzels and coating it. And I had half a mind to like try to like make light of it. I was like, hey, if you want to like add a little extra cinnamon to one, I'll pay extra. But I don't mind if you like, you know, like super cinnamon the thing front and back and everything. Because I freaking love it. And I'm not saying anything bad about Wetzel's pretzels. This is no way bad about Wetzel's pretzels. So if anybody's trying to like turn my words into like, oh man, I guess that Wetzel's pretzel will shame on them. No, because I know that Wetzel pretzel spot, I don't go to them all often, but excuse me. Ooh, excuse me. Uh, but whenever I go to the Wetzel Pretzel spot, I know they're usually busy, so I'm not really all that surprised or anything. Uh, I did that, right? Yeah, I did that. Um, anything else? Any secrets before I go do this, uh, boss thingy? 
I don't think so. Sorry, I'm just... Oh, wait, hold on. Double checking for this. And you found out one of those treasure roads. Um, so, hey, you remember those kids that I was telling you about that were, like, laughing about uh, me knocking into that old lady? Yeah, so guess who was sitting at a table maybe, like, ten steps away? It was those kids, and they were, like, texting, but at first I was like, I didn't want to look at them, but I was like, okay, well, clearly they aren't going to remember, or maybe they're just, like, thinking about something else. Maybe they finally, like, let it go. Nope, because one of the kids was just, like, kept looking my direction every now and then. I kept seeing a smile, and I was just like, ugh, uh, just please, let me just get this and get out of here. I, I had half a mind to just, like, leave the spot, but I was already, like, already told them, and they were like, oh, we'll shout out to you when the pretzels are done, so I felt like a jerk if I, like, left. But it was embarrassing because, like, these kids kept staring, and maybe, yeah, it's probably my assumption. They might not have been talking about me, is what you would think. But every now and then I kept on, like, staring, and, and, like, the other one kept staring, too, and one of them kept pointing it my direction. And let me tell y'all right now, there's nothing beside me but, like, a pillar, and, yeah, there's, like, some, like, Claire's or whatever this, like, spot is, but these kids were not pointing at Claire's. They were not pointing at it. Like, y'all may not believe me, fine, but they were not talking about Claire's. They were in my, they were looking in my direction, and every now and then they had little gestures at me, and I was like, all right, clearly they're still talking about me basically just knocking down this old lady as if I was a baseball trying to steal a, a baseball player trying to steal a base. But eventually I got the cinnamon pretzel, and it was all good. I got the Cinnabits. And they were like, oh, if you want, you can have, like, a cinnamon pretzel. Like, we'll give you half off for waiting. And I was like, you know what? That's really pleasant. Thank you. And they offered me icing. I actually don't like icing with my cinnamon pretzel. So I was like, all right, cool. Uh, all right, let's do this. Clear the stage. That's it? All right. Um, so, yeah, I was just, like, getting the, the cinnamon pretzel and everything. I put the cinnamon pretzel... I put the cinnamon bits... Uh, excuse me. I put the cinnamon pretzel... I left it wrapped up in the bag, and I put it in my backpack, because I was like, I could just munch on it later. And I was getting the cinnamon bits, and I was just munching on it as I was, like, heading to where my folks were. Uh, and I was like, okay, let me just... Wait. Music. Boom! 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 You scared the crap out of me. Uh, secrets? Any secrets? Nothing? Alright, no? Okay. Um, Bayo did see the message. Sorry, I'm, I'm just... I got a tie right here. Uh... Wait, I see a poster over there. Let me guess. Is it knock posters again? Like the other level? Freeze! Is it? Ah, uh, no. Not. Um. But yeah, no, I was getting the set of bits. Uh, I got my set of bits. I was munching them. I was like, alright, let me just, like, go with my folks. Let's just get out of here. I just need to, a day to just, like... I just need to go home and just chill and relax. Um. I got told from my folks, hey, so the internet's, like, being, like, fixed up. So we may not have a... What the frick was that? Something just moved. Was that the monkey thing? Was that the giant monkey? There's a giant monkey about to fight, isn't it? I saw the shadow of something swing over there. I think I wasn't paying attention. It's Donkey Kong. I bet I'm fighting Donkey Kong. Look, it's clearly Donkey Kong. Look at all these bananas. I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna be upset. Uh, he's gonna be upset. Sorry, I'm hungry. Uh, I'm sure I'll probably be okay. Still haven't discovered a secret thing yet? Oh, weird. Whoa. Y'all see that? My screen was shaking for a second. Uh, ooh. Ice, bomb, and sword. Um, I'll do bomb because I can kind of run away and drop some bombs. Over here? No? Okay. Nothing? All right. Uh, oh, I just keep going. But anyway, yeah, so I was gonna go meet my folks. They're like, hey, our internet's, like, down, so it's gonna be, like, a... Whoa. Uh, that's not Donkey Kong. That is definitely not Donkey Kong. That's Donkey Kong's much older brother. No, that's Donkey Kong's, like, bully that would slap him around when he was a kid and be like, give me your lunch money. Bet money it is. Um... Should I just finish the, the Cinnabits thing? Let me just finish the Cinnabits thing. I'll, I'll continue the rest. Let me just finish the Cinnabits thing. So, the Cinnabits thing happened was... And I know somebody's wondering, so what happened to your Cinnabits be? Okay, well, let me tell you. Uh, first, they were telling me the internet was down, so it was going to be like a little bit while, but a little while. But by the time we got there, hopefully we'd be fixed. I was like, all right, well, that kind of throws away my plans because I really wanted to, like, uh, organize my stream. I want to, like, schedule my next set of videos. So, I guess I'll just do it later. It's not that big a deal. Um... Luckily, I had, like, reception on my phone, so I was just like, you know what, let me just go and check my YouTube. I got hit with 
a, a copyright thing. Not a strike. I got hit with like this copyright thing for my Prince of Persia videos. Um, because apparently there's like more audio stuff in that. Even though I've finished, by the time this video is done, I finished my Prince of Persia playthrough. So I was like, oh, wait, what? Why am I getting still hit with this? So I I didn't really know what to do with this, so I left it. But it kind of bummed me out because I didn't know what to do with it. I hope that doesn't, like, set, like, anything bad. Like, I'm not trying to claim, like, any muse or anything. But I didn't know what I was playing that was bad. Which is why I have this whole, like, fear when it comes to, like, playing games with, like, music and licensed music and stuff. As we all do. Um... And yes, this is again a kind of thing on me. But to be fair, it was also for these two guys who were like these like really like buff dudes. Well, one of them was buff. One of them was like wearing layers. So I don't know. But they were like tossing this like toy football. And so there's like a hallway leading to like the exit. And one of them was just like playing with the football. And yes, it's on my part too because I was looking at my phone checking this out as they were just playing with it. And I knew I heard someone say go something. I don't know because I don't know sports, but I, was, I heard go or go or something like that. Like it was a really like deep voice dude. And I saw it and the guy was like tossing the football in my direction. And this one guy was like charging at me, but he was obviously not paying attention. His focus was on the thing. They were just like coming around. And I was like, okay, let me just like quickly like, dash out of the way. <laughs> I, the best way I could describe what happened was, you know how if like somebody's walking towards you, like if you're walking one path and somebody's walking towards you, normally... You, it's, I guess, it's, I don't know if it's instinctual, like, you maybe walk to the left, they maybe walk to their left, you avoid them. So, my idea was, I'm right-handed, I'll quickly jump to the right to avoid the guy. That guy decided to go to the left, and we ran to each other and knocked my cinnabits down to the ground. And obviously, I'm not eating any cinnabits touching the ball floor, like, y'all know malls are not the cleanest sometimes. And the guy was like, oh, my bad, dude, and it... I'll admit, I'm a scrawny guy. The guy kind of like really like charged into me. It hurt like heck. And there were people watching. So again, I was on the spot for that. So I was like, nah, man, it's all good. And I was just like, oh, it really hurt. And I was like getting up and I was like, oh, they were often like, oh, now nah, like we could treat you like more cinnabits. I was like, oh, you know what? This is probably karma is what I thought to myself. Because I accidentally knocked the lady, uh, the old lady. And now these like, these big dudes are like knocking into me. So maybe someone out there just, just has some really twisted sense of humor. But my Cinnabits were done, so I was like, I can't eat them, so, and I was really bummed. I still had my Cinnabit pretzel, but it was still just, like, another inconvenience on top of that. And there were just people watching. I know someone's all like, oh, wait, were those kids there? No, at least as far as I saw, the kids weren't there. But what was probably just as embarrassing was those guys were not alone. They had these two, like, or these three, like, really pretty girls. Again, this is just on my assumption. All three of them were attractive. I don't want to think... All three of them were, like, tethered. But it's one of those just typical, oh, well, you see a cute girl. Maybe are they with someone? But I assume, like, two of them were with the guy. One of them must have been at least three. But, like, one of them started to giggle. The other girl was, like, concerned. The other girl, I didn't really pay much attention to her. But the really cute one was just like, uh, are, she was really attractive. It's like, oh, are you okay? Like, trying to offer help. And I was like, no, 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 I'm good, I'm good. And I'm just, like, getting in there. My side did hurt, but I was, like, getting... I. Picked, I got up, I picked up the Cinnabits, I threw them in the trash. I was like, no, 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 you're good. They were like, you're sure? I was like, no, no, I'm straight, I'm straight, I'm good. And I was just leaving, and I was just like, ugh. Because it was just, like, a lot. Like, it was just so much that happened. And then we got home. Obviously, I'm obviously home, because you hear me stream. Uh, the internet was fixed. Uh, I still don't know what's going on with the whole, like, copyright thing. Um, and then for, like, a good period of time, this is not me saying this. I'm going to end this right now because I don't want to play the game. This is not me saying this to entice people to sympathize. This is not me saying this to get people to support me. I'm well aware as a content creator, I'm not going to be an instant success overnight. And I don't think I will be. But it was one of the things where I usually check whenever my videos premiere. I was like, oh, I wonder if I got any people. And I noticed I actually lost a couple subscribers. Um, nobody left on Twitch, God forbid. Uh, by the time this video's out, but I lost a couple of people on YouTube, and I know it's the whole thing where I can't keep everyone's attention. It is what it is. But I did have that one thought of, like, man, am I really not, like... I like doing this for me, and it's a hobby, but I really want people to... I, I had this weird eternal thing. I was like, I wonder if there's something I'm doing wrong that people aren't liking, right? So it was just... I was just talking circles in my head, and that just kind of bummed me out further. I was like, you know what? I can't... I can't deal with this. So you know what I did to cheer myself up? I decided to eat my cinnamon pretzel... After this is done, I'm going to order some food, and I decided, you know what? I don't want to be in this iffy state playing Master Detectives. I want to be able to play something that will cheer me up. So, that's the reason why I was bummed out. I apologize. This was a really long rant of a tirade, but I felt like, you know what? 
I need something to be, to be the cure for me. Like, I like to keep things to myself, but... And I don't really like sharing my feelings, but it was just like, you know what? Let me just share it, and maybe I can laugh about it. And you know what? I'm actually laughing about it now. Because nobody's permanently hurt. Everyone's okay. Uh, yeah, maybe I may not be able to talk to that girl, but I probably wasn't going to talk to her anyway, because I'm super shy. And you know what? We could all just laugh about it. So I'm laughing about it now, and I'm feeling better because I got her off my plate. I'm playing Kirby. I'm having a great time. So yes, I apologize. I had to like vent it out, but I just, I just, I feel better now, right? I'm playing this cool Kirby game. I'm having fun. Uh, I can't leave. The monkey dude's looking at me. Kind of cute looking. Hey. Uh. Ah! Uh, are you angry that I ate your animals? Oh, cute. Ow! Okay, well, maybe I should have mashed it. Strong arm beast, Gormondo. All right, let's do this, monkey. Oh, wait, hold on. What is this boss music? Whoa! All right, I'm done. Don't worry. No more tirade. I'll focus on you viewers. And by focus on you viewers, I mean focus on trying not to get crushed by Monkey Boy. By Monkey Man from Hey Arnold. Does anybody remember that? Does anybody remember Hey Arnold? Clearly the parts with Monkey Man? For, you, for people who don't know, Hey Arnold had like this episode where it had this like vigilante that like saved Arnold from bullies. And apparently he claimed himself to be like, uh, you know how they have like Batman and kick ass. So it's this like superhero themed after monkeys. I don't remember his whole thing other than I guess he, I don't know if he was one of those things who like grew up in the jungle or had a pet monkey or something, but he called himself Monkey Man. And what was funny about it was that he only knew how to like, he spoke normal sentences, but every time he said something, he'd be like, oh, hello viewers. How are you, Monkey Man? Uh, how are you doing today? And he would be like, wait, what did you just say? It's like, no, I didn't say anything, Monkey Man. I didn't say anything. What's wrong? Like, like, you clearly just said Monkey Man. No, I didn't say Monkey Man. I didn't say anything like that. What are you saying? So weird, man. Come on. Don't be, don't be silly. I, pr I wonder if I got anybody. Oh! Oh, you was close. Actually, you know what? Hold on. I'm going to stay quiet for a little bit. I want to listen to this music for a quick second. Uh, just in case I get in trouble, I don't want to do it. No, no, get away. Doing the Zongief tornado. Uh, well, I know what I'll be looking up after this. Kirby boss music. Let me just make a mental note for myself. Whoa. Wait, I just thought of something. If I'm doing this fight, what are the secret things? Yeah, I never discovered the four secret things. Unless there's something with the boss I'm supposed to do. Well, I'm assuming it'll tell me. Which probably means I'll probably have to replay the fight. Got nothing, monkey boy. Monkey man. Oh! My brain. Ugh. I also noticed. I, I paid attention. I didn't say anything just yet. But he had like a necklace that was basically, oh, hey, Ethelin, where were you? You could have helped me a little bit. Oh, well, uh, I was I was going to help, but uh, I had to tie my shoes. You're not wearing shoes. Yeah, well, uh, good observation. Go, go see the Wildies. Oh, hell yeah. Heck yeah, stage cleared. Oh, it's so cute. What did I have to do? Slip through Gormondo's legs. Oh wait, he only reveals the game only reveals one at a time. All right, well, gotta figure out the rest of it, I guess. Slip through Gormondo's legs. Pause. Don't take that out of context. Slip through Gormondo's legs. How's that gonna work? Oh well, I'm gonna have to redo it. Also, do I know people for Waddle D Mall Wall Wall Place? Oh, never mind. It's gonna take me to Waldy Town. I was gonna go there afterwards, but all right. Yay! Oh, that's new. Little spot on the spot. Capsule machine. Oh no! They have a gotcha machine. Are you serious? Gotcha machine volume one is now available. Turn the crank to get a figure. Try to collect the whole set. Oh no. What was this the little Zelda hat thing with a scroll? Baldi's Weapon Shops is now open. Head here to make your copy abilities even stronger. Ooh. 
That sounds like I need to go there now. Yo, what the frick is that over there? Hey, check it out. It's got like some hat. Uh, it's from that green boy, that, that fairy boy from the, the Legend of Zelda games. What's his name? Zelda? You should go talk to it. This place has gotten much livelier now that the townsfolk are finding their way back. The other Waldies said they really appreciate your help, Kirby. Trust me, I can speak, I, I flew it in 19 different languages. I'm always ready to help too, yeah, I know, you're always willing to help, thanks. Okay, so I need 50 for that. How many do I have? 42? Actually, that's not too far off. What's up, Evelyn? Ooh, look, Waldie's weapon shops is open. Looks like a quick way to grab copy abilities. I also heard the Wildy inside knows the secret of growing stronger. Let's pay him a visit. Alright, say less. I'm going in. Hey, what's up? Welcome to Waldy's weapon shop. I work with all types of copy abilities. It's kind of my thing. Any copy abilities you find out there will become available here. Pop in and grab one anytime. Oh, and guess what else? I can help you evolve those abilities to make them much stronger. This blueprint contains some incredible techniques. We can use it to evolve your ability for a low, low price of $98,000. Tipping and handing included. Let's try evolving one right now. I'll ready my tools, as well as get my lovely assistant Bernice to help me. Bernice? Oh, he's just the most darling assistant. Helps me at anything, and I truly mean everything. Thanks for waiting. The cutter ability can now be evolved into Chakram Cutter. Thanks for waiting. The fire ability can now be evolved into Volcano Fire. That actually sounds kind of dope. Uh, do I just, do I talk to you to do it, or? Stand in front of the ability you want to evolve, then press A to see the details. Okay, well, uh, I like fire, so I'll do fire. To evolve this copy ability, you need star coins and- Oh, that's why those star- Oh, that's why those treasure roads are gonna be important. I need star coins. So I need star coins and rare stones to evolve my copy ability. You can find rare stones on the treasure roads hidden throughout the world map. Try those out. I prepped everything in advance this time, so we're all set. You don't have to worry about it this time. Oh, it's for free? Oh, sweet. Oh, you, you're giving them to me. Oh, thanks. Uh, this ability is hot, hot, hot. Light fuses, burn through obstacles, and toast your enemies with the power of a raging fire. Run, jump, and then attack to blast forth a fireball. Okay, yeah, let me do Volcano Fire. Uh, it looks like it increases the power a bit and Rapid Fire a slight bit. Who's this Bernice guy? Oh, he's just the most lovely thing. Here, I'll get some help. Yo, Bernice! Fire up the grill now! Oh, that's it? I kind of thought there'd be more of a cutscene. Alright. Uh, am I safe to have a volcano on my head? I'm gonna assume I am. Success! Means success! All done! The fire ability is evolved with Volcano Fire. If you find more blueprints, just bring them to me. I'll use them to evolve your abilities even further. Okay. Okay, I need to do the boom push. This volcano is erupting. Harness the power of geothermal energy to spew lava in front of you. Blaze your enemies and make them feel the heat. Oh, let me do the... Can I do the chocolate one? Uh, power is still the same, but the rapid fire is a lot quicker, huh? Use it to grab fire items, hold the button down to freeze it midair and charge it up. The money should have a powerful switch. Oh, yeah, yeah. Let's do it. Hey, can you get that Bernice guy to eat? Yeah, we already know. Bernice, activate the the grill. Oh, not the grill. What is it? The for Activate the forge. Yeah, I said the grill. Y'all know what I meant. The forge for strengthening weapons. Oh, it looks cute. That looks way more cuter than the volcano on my head. I should try it. Go for it. Oh, that's why it's rapid fire. I could throw two at once. And I can hold it to charge. Okay. Let me try the volcano one then. Oh, I don't just breathe fire, I just lob lava. I still do the... Okay. That's kind of neat. 
putter and I oh it's over here. Mr. Sandbag. Oh, it's like a testing dummy. To, like test my abilities. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. Whoa! Wait, I can make the fire stronger? I can make the fire stronger. Oh, that's awesome. It's still taking damage. Oh, okay. Noted. Alright, I'll come back when I get more rare stones and stuff. Kinda neat. Alright, I kinda see its perks. When you're ready to explore some more, just hop into the warp star and fly to a new area. Well, I do want to try Monkey Boy again. Oh, what's up? Uh, well, when the Waltys were first being captured, I thought I would end up all alone again. But I met you, Kirby. You worked so hard to save everyone rebuild this town. Thank you so much, Kerbo. It's, it's, it's actually Kirby. what I say? That's what I said. Kerbo. That's what your name is. No, it's it's Kirby. That's what I said. Kerbo. Alright, Fern. Whatever. Uh, before I do go, I gotta do it at least once, right? This little, like, gotcha machine alley. You don't need an alley for one gotcha machine. Oh, this is bad. Oh, no, I can get lost in this. All right, I mean, I'm coming back to this later. This logo belonged to an auto shop named Holine Custom Autos, part of Holine Corp. Holine also sold industrial parts, managed construction, and made all kinds of stuff. From buildings to streets to amusement park rides, remember, if it's quality, it's Holine. Holine, 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 Holine! Oh, I probably get copyright for that. Uh, perhaps it was would be more accurate. No, 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 no. I'll come back for that later. I'll, I'll make a note to try and do that. If I make this more of a series, if you viewers want to see more of a series, then uh, I'll make a habit at least do a couple of that episode. I'll come back when I get more blueprints and stuff. Okay, so I want to try fighting Gormando again. Because I guess all the secret stuff is based off the boss. Oh, in the second area, the second world? Everbay Coast. Oh, that just looks lovely. It looks pretty. Beat a boss and open up a new area. Cool. I will definitely go there. Not this episode. Bandit Beach? Alright, cool. What I am gonna do... Do this again. Okay, so slip through Gormando's legs. I don't know what the other three will be, but... I guess what's nice is... If I do it, then at least will tell me. Give me an idea of what I need to do. Now I have Volcano Fire. Which I don't know will be better. I don't know if Volcano Fire or Chakram will be better. Because the Chakram, at least I can, like, avoid the enemy, Gormando. Yeah, I saw you this time, buddy. I don't know, I'll try Volcano Fire. I just gotta worry about slipping through his legs. Which, I'm gonna assume I could just run for it. Ice, bomb, sword. Yeah, it's probably better. There's no chakram here. Alright. Y'all, I'll try this again. See if I can get more of the uh, Waldies viewers. If I am gonna do another... Well, I am gonna do another one visit of this. It'll probably be the second area. I'll try a little further. Oh, skip? Yeah. Fuck! Ah! Okay, this time I'm ready for it. Let me go! There we go! I gotta slip through your legs. Excuse me! Okay. Burn, 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 burn. You're not gonna hurt me from stepping on me, are you? Whoa! Whoa! Okay. Actually, wait. What is there? What if there's like no damage or something? You are a boss. What the? Oh, well, so much of the damage thing. I was gonna say, some boss games will be like, oh, you get an achievement if you don't take damage. So I was like, alright, well, I took damage. Where my volcano fire? Well, I took damage, so might as well just go ham. Uh oh. Run! Oh, that's close. That's a little too close. That's really close. Go, go away! Alright, go. Oh yeah, hold on. Uh, Volcano Fire might do some work here. That was way quicker too. Jeez. Volcano Fire might be kind of dope. And that's just, what, the second one? I wonder how many evolutions we get. Might be nice to like go for multiple. Be within two minutes. Oh, it's a time thing too? 
Okay. So I slid through Gormando's legs, and I, um... I can't get over the dance. I just can't. I slid through Gormando's legs. I clear the two. Beat Gormando with the sword ability. Oh. That means I'm not going to be able to have a boost. Alright, fine. I have to do it. Beat Gormando with sword? Yeah, I can do it real quick. Be back in town, boys. Gormando with sword. Gormando with sword. What would the last one be? What if it is no damage? What if it's take no damage? Because I did technically get hit. I got grabbed, which apparently counted as something. I thought it was only if I didn't mash, but... I'll try the sword, and I really hope I'm wrong. Maybe it's like another ability thing. Defeat it with ice or something. But it makes sense. It would make sense, right? Like, don't uh, get hurt while fighting it. Because there's one for time. There's one for using a sword ability. What else could it pop? Well, I don't know. I've been wrong before. But I don't know what else it could possibly be. I mean, I'll know one way or another. Oh, I don't get sword beam. Lame. Oh, okay. I gotta remember to start holding a E to try things. Hey! Hey! Come here. Get over here. Come on, you. Let's do this. Let me out! Alright. I'm gonna try not to take damage, even though I'm probably gonna take damage. Wait for him to do the, the swingy thingy. When he tries to swing his arms at me. That works too. That does some damage. Alright. Uh oh. I have to beat him with sword. Whoa! Ah, oh, man. Don't jump away from me. Come here. Don't throw rocks, don't throw rocks. Did your parents ever teach you not to throw rocks at people? Ooh, I'm surprised I didn't get hurt from that. You know what? Wait for you to throw your rock. Oh, you're gonna keep throwing rocks. Ah, stop it, Gormando. do more damage. Oh, wait. I can spin, too. If I wait until he gets dizzy, then I can spin and charge up and do more damage. Uh, please stop. Please stop. Please stop. Please stop soon. Oh, go. Uh-oh. Ooh. Ooh, okay. So far, so good. So far, so good. Be. You can do it a little bit more. Especially if you get this from spin. I got the tears. I'll do it. I'll do it. Running out of road here. Okay. No, oh, got him. Ooh, I got him. I'm gonna laugh if there wasn't a damage thing. If it was like, oh, I had to like use another ability or something. Okay, defeat him with sword. Oh, I, damn it! I thought it was I thought it was gonna be a no damage thing. Alright, whatever. Guess it'll tell me. Then again, I get to see this dance again. That's kinda nice. Hey! What did I do? Oh, it is clear to without taking any damage! Woo! Oh, I, 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 I gave up hope. Sorry, viewers. I apologize for any headphone warner uh, wearers. I gave up hope. I was like, oh man, I am broken. I thought it was over. So, I was able to do it without damage. That's lucky, but oh, that was also tough. It shouldn't be. 
But it's probably because I don't really know probably what I'm doing. You saved all the nat uh, Waldies and natural planes. Way to go, Kirby, you workaholic. Hey, man, I just like doing it. I mean, if I can, I can. So that's everything, right? Is there anything else? I've done that. Nice to be oh, it's nice to be surrounded by all this greenery. Right, Kirby? Yeah, it is. It actually is kind of nice. Wait, what? Uh, oh, I was about to say. It better be a... Ugh, darn it. I was hoping for more treasure road things. I'm gonna need... Uh, wait. I didn't do this. Bending mouth treasure. I think that's the last thing. I don't think there's anything else. Is there something I'm missing? Aldi Town? No. I think that's it. What do you say, viewers? We do one last treasure road thingy, the Bending Mouth Challenge. Okay, gotta do it in a minute 20. Pop shots, a bending adventure. Alright, let's do it. We'll do this, and then we'll probably call it an episode. Alright, it's gotta be quick. I don't deny none. Oh, then screw this. I'm just gonna go. I don't know if I'm faster. Ow! You will not. You will not hinder us. Yo, go. I don't know if I'm faster doing this jump thing. Oh, go, go, go! Get out of the way! Get out of the way! Get out of the way! Oh man, I gotta be quick. I don't know if this is actually faster. Ow! Screw it. Ooh, I'm, I'm coasting, I'm coasting. Turn this way. It's not turning the way I want it. Shoot the switch! Why is it to shoot the switch? Oh, because I have to hit that switch. Oh, that was such a waste of time. Yeah. Alright, hit the switch! Oh, man, I did apparently. I'll try to be fast. Do it away. Took too much damage. Every time I take damage, I end up, like, being slow. I'm gonna have to redo this one. How bad did I do? I, I know where I've messed up. I can do that quicker. Oh, I did it! Oh, never mind! I, ooh, well, I barely did it. Ooh, that was a little too close for comfort. I thought when I, uh, I thought when I died and fell down there, I would have boned. You know what? I'll take it. Phew, which means I don't have to redo it. Uh, is there any way to, like, heck, uh, that just get me so excited? Yeah, that's the word. Especially when I'm with you, Kirby. Oh, uh, stageless. Yeah, okay. I was about to say, is there any way to, like, check, like, uh, progress? Okay, so I got all the Waldies. Uh, X for Treasure Road. Yeah. I got them. Alright, I think that means Natural Plane is completely done, which means this will actually be an episode, viewers. I apologize for me venting about my, uh, very interesting day, we'll say the least. But next episode, which, yes, like I said, this may be a one visit, but I am going to do another episode. I will do another part, and I'll probably do the other world. Um, but like stated, if you want to see more, or if you want to see me complete this uh, to whatever degree, then let me know. Please hit me with some follows and subscribes. I don't want to do the whole, like, hey, if you want to, like, help me get to 100 uh, followers or anything, which is still my goal. But I'm not going to do the whole, like, hey, get me, like, this many subs or this many subscribers. But I'm trying to appeal to your good faith. Not your sympathy, but your good faith, and maybe you guys are detained. So, if you like this game, uh, which I hope you do because it's Kirby and it's adorable, and you really should because it's Kirby, then by all means, please uh, make sure to follow me, make sure to subscribe, and then let me know in the comment section. Tell me on Discord. Let me know in the comment section. The more people that do it, the more I'll be like, oh, wow, clearly people really want to see uh, this thing. And, yeah, I can always do the whole, like, oh, we'll just go by views or keep doing it. And I know some people are like, well, you should just do whatever you're comfortable with. It's like, I am, I am. Like, I guarantee you, I will give you another episode, at least. Because one visits, I usually do one to three. But after that, for sure, I will let it up to you viewers. Because I do have other things. And this is technically just a spur of the moment thing. Because I was just having a very in bedful day. We'll just say that much. So, thank you all for tuning in for this episode. On behalf of Kirby, on behalf of Evelyn, and on behalf of Bandana Wallowsy. I can't thank you all enough for tuning in. Make sure to follow, make sure to subscribe, make sure to like, and make sure to... 
well, get some good food in you, but make sure you don't bite off more than you can chew. Hey yo. Nonetheless, I hope to see all of you, my lovely connoisseurs of the culture, in the next episode.